What up, Wargamers? Welcome back to the channel. I'm your host, Stoss. And today I have Dwayne with me. Yes, you do. Heck Dwayne yeah. Lee here. And we are back for another game of Warhammer Fantasy 6th Edition. That's right. We are back for another of the King of Editions. Indeed. And today it is going to be 2,000 points of the Vampire Counts versus... 2,000 points for the Vampire Counts. Amazing! <laughs> Look at this. It is dead versus dead. It's yes. spooky versus rotting. So cool. Um, and yeah, I'm taking, as per usual, my uh, my Blood Dragon Vampire Bloodline, uh, Dragislav von Kurz. And what are you doing, sir? I'm taking the Strigoi, just because you haven't had them on the show yet. This is true. So, there you go. My so general's cool. name is Malakas. Ooh. Not Malaka, huh? <laughs> <laughs> There's my an S at the end. <laughs> um, but yeah, so cool. Um, like you said, haven't had the Strigoi bloodline here yet, Correct. so yep. awesome to get them. Mm -hmm. And you've got the sweet old thick 6th edition metal yes. rings. They yep, are the original and the best. They're so good, they're so good. Um, lots of ghouls and interesting stuff. So yeah, it's going to be it's going to be an interesting fight. It's going it to be yeah. um, you know uh, raw power versus martial prowess. It will be, which is super super cool. This is the grand finale in our DC trilogy, our Dwayne Christos trilogy. <laughs> this is the finale, the my DC friends. DC trilogy. We've, had, we've had one win here, one win here. This is the decider. I this think. is the one. <laughs> this is the one, and of course, and with you know. The, the same faction, you know? Yes. Yeah. We come together with the, the, the double <laughs> vampire, which is super cool. And it's going to be really weird because neither of our armies are going to be subject to fear. Yep. We're not going to be fleeing. Well, if... my ghouls might be. Ghouls but, could uh, be. Yep. Ghouls could be. Yeah, the, the, the only... The, that's, yeah, apart from them, that, that'll be it. It'll yeah, man. Be... It's going to be grind. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a grind fest, you know? Bloody yeah. uh, units are going to hit and then they're just going to be who crumbles the most? Who can keep them raised? It's going to be... Exactly. It's going to be very cool. Um, uh, but we will get to all of that in a minute. Now, if you are interested in supporting the channel, consider becoming a channel member. It is our channel members that absolutely are keeping the lights on here, figuratively speaking. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> but they are giving me resources to continue to invest in this channel. You exactly. know, new models, new equipment, all the stuff. So if you want to support us here, consider becoming a channel member. Now, Speaking of channel members, I've got a few new ones to shout Ooh, out today. Very yes. nice. Amazing. Thanks, guys. So, coming in at core choice, we have Warren McIntosh and Sam Sharp. Coming in at special choice, we have Suikdal1337. And then, at rare choice, the rarest of shout outs, we have Peak Chiropractic Kinesiology. Yes, I said it. Yes. <laughs> it's a mouthful. <laughs> And Sarah New. Now, I'm not sure if that's Sarah or Sarah, but I'm going with Sarah. My apologies. Either way, I gave it a shot. But guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much for deciding to support the channel. It is because of bosses like this that you guys get to watch these videos. So big ups, guys. Thank you so much. Hit um, that join button and support Christos's plastic crack addiction. My man! My plastic <laughs> crack! My plastic crack! You know it and love it, just like me. <laughs> We all love it. Though. Hell yeah, we do. Um, otherwise, go through the usual YouTube things, guys. Whack a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you're not already. Write a comment. Let me know what you thought. But without any further ado, we'll have a look at the armies. We'll have a look at the table. And then we will get this underway. And here we have my 2,000 points of Blood Dragon Vampire Counts. All right, starting out with the general, we have Dragislav von Kurz. He is just getting played as a vampire count this time, rather than the vampire lord. Um, he is going to be armed with the Sword of Might, giving him plus one strength. The Flayed Halberk, giving him a one-up armor save. And uh, the Ring of the Night, giving him a five-up ward save. So yeah, just uh, no bloodline abilities, just, just magic weapons and armor. Just the, the, the tanky count. <laughs> um, and he is a level two. Level two wizard, vampire count. All right, and today I have brought a brand new, freshly painted model. It is a white king. Yes, or a white lord, I think it is in this edition. This is King Cranon the Mad. <laughs> once, uh, once a warrior king of old and now raised by Dragus Love to do his dark bidding. So he's going to be armed with heavy armor, an enchanted shield, 
and the Sword of Kings, which gives him um, the Killing Blow ability, goes off on a 5 up rather than a 6 up. So yeah, 3 up armor save with the, the Enchanted Shield, Killing Blow on a 5 up, there he is, King Krannon. All right, coming down to the Necromancers, we have two level two Necromancers. On the left, we have Kaiser, Kaiser Blackhand. He has the Book of Arcan and a Dispel Scroll. And then we have Grigori the Rotting, and he has a Power Familiar, which gives him plus one Power and Dispel Dice, just to, just to mitigate the removal of all Dragus Loves One for being a Blood Dragon. So yes, go on the vampire count, four heroes this time. We'll see how it goes. All right, moving into the core, we have two units of dire wolves, both with a doom wolf leading the pack. We have 28 zombies because of points with a banner and musician, no champion zombie because there isn't one. 25 skeletons, hand weapon, shields, light armor, and full command. Moving into the special, we have a huge brick of Graveguard, almost a maxed out unit, 29. 29 Graveguard with their white blades, heavy armor, shields, and full command, and they have the banner of the Barrows, which gives any whites in the unit a native three up to hit. Pretty spicy. And then continuing with the special, we have six Black Knights uh, with all of the upgrades, full command, barding, heavy armor, lances, the whole shebang. And then lastly, we've got three little flap flaps, the Fell Bats. And that is it. That is the army. It's, it's a little bit different. Uh, I've gone maxed out Grave Guard. I've got a Vampire Count, bringing a White King, which I'm pretty excited about. But that is it. That is the 2000 points of Blood Dragon <laughs> Vampire Counts. And here we have Dwayne's 2,000 points of Strigoi Bloodline Vampire Counts. All right, Dwayne, take us through it, mate. So we have our Vampire Count. He is the general. He's a level two wizard. He has regeneration. Oh, <laughs> amazing. 55 points. And he's got infinite hatred, so he rerolls all missed attacks. Spicy. Oh my god. And Strigoi's come base with plus one attack. And a yep. count comes with a five up ward save as well. So That's right. He's got a five up ward save and then a four up regenerate. Oh, he's going to be hard <laughs> to kill. Oh my god. Very good. And we've got his little helper. Yes, his thrall. He, uh, he has infinite hatred, so he rerolls all missed attacks, and he has plus one strength because of iron sinews. Oh, very nice. Next to him, we've got our white lord. He's mounted. His mount has biting. He's got a lance, heavy armor, and a shield. He's also carrying the cursed book, which means everything within six inches gets a negative one to hit. Oh, that's spicy. That's gonna be interesting. We'll see how that ends up working out. Very nice. And next to him is our necromancer. He looks familiar. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna fight off with his twin later yeah, in this battle. Yeah, very good. Um, so, our necromancer is a level two wizard. He has the Book of Arcan. And he has a power stone as well. Spicy, very good. They are not only like the same miniature and painted very similar, they are also like uh, like mirrors of each other in terms of equipment. Nemesis. The Book of Arcan as well. I have the Dispel Scroll and you got the Power Stone. Yep. Amazing. So cool. <laughs> All right, moving into core, sir. On the left side, we have two units of five die wolves. Very cool. The old metal rigs. Very Both nice. led by a Doom Wolf each. Love it. I should actually change oh. that around. You did. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Cool. Uh, next to them, we've got two units of skeletons. One unit has spears, no light armor, spears and shields, 15 of them. And next to them, we've got 12 skeletons with uh, hand weapons and shields. Very nice. All come with a standard and musician. Standard musician, no champ. The champ is in the unit of hand weapons. Champ? Yep, that's no there. champ. Correct. Very good. Um, just behind them, we've got our bat swarms. Nice. Bat Four swarms. bases of the swarms of bats. I love them because they are combat res proof. <laughs> <laughs> that they are. They are unbreakable. Exactly. And alive, so they will not just crumble. Love that. And speaking of alive, we have three units of cannibals. Oh, Filthy the ghoulie boys. Amazing. Each oh. unit comes with a ghast, which is the hunchback one. Heck yeah. Unit. Very nice. And six per unit? Six per unit. Very nice. 
All right, sir, moving into special. Special, we have 10 Black Knights. Ooh, the big brick, very nice. The standard bearer has the... What's that flag called again? It's it the is Banner the, of the Barrows. That's the one, Banner of the Barrows. Hitting on threes. Very nice. Uh, they're led by a champion, Hell Knight. Uh, they all have biting. Nice. And we have a musician. Cool. Sweet. And then lastly, the Flap Flaps. Yes, yeah, six fell bats. Very good. Very cool. We have both similar and different lists all at once. So you've gone skeleton heavy, whereas I've got some zombies. Mm -hmm. Lots of ghouls because you gotta, because you know, Stragoi. Got a big unit of knights to my small unit of knights, big unit of fell bats. This is interesting. <laughs> Very interesting. But there it is. That is the 2000 points of Stragoi Vampire Counts. Rolling for the spells for the Blood Dragon Vampires. And starting off with Sir Dragislav himself, only rolling two because it's just a little count this time. Um, and I want I want some Van Hells, so looking for fives here, people. Ha! Ooh, amazing! I it. immediately get Van Hells and Invocation of Nehek. Beautiful, <laughs> love that. What a fantastic start. Let's keep that up. All right, and then Kaiser Black Hand. Oh, amazing, also gets Van Hells. <laughs> You're and then kidding. a re-roll of four, which is Gaze of Nagash. Mm, I will swap that out for mm -hmm. Invocation of Nehek. So at the moment, amazing. I've got two Van Hells and two Invocations. Perfect. Um, now I think I would like a Hellish Figure. A Hellish Figure for a three. Give it to me! Ah! He's got him. <laughs> I can get everything I want! Um, and I will take of Invocation course. of Nehek as well. <laughs> Look at that! I, did, uh, I called for what I wanted and the dark gods of necromancy <laughs> gave it to me! <laughs> Lovely. All right. Heck yeah, that was pretty spicy. That is the spells for the Blood Dragons. Rolling up the spells for the Strigoi. Starting off with Malakas. Yes, Malakas. Let's go. I want what you've got. <laughs> Let's do this. Oh, oh I get it! Amazing! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to keep them. You taking Thank them both? Thank you very much. Oh, yes, amazing. Oh, no invocation though, mate. No invocation. But Spicy. That's okay. All right. That's okay. And then two for his necromancer henchman. Mm. Three and four. Hellish vigor okay. and gaze of Nagash. Um, okay, I'm going to go with gaze of Nagash. Ooh. Spicy. And Invocation. Invocation. Makes sense. Very good. So we've got the top end spells for the top dog, Malachas. And then uh, the, the the utility spells yes. for the little man. Very nice. There are the spells for the Strigoi. And here we are, all set up and deployed for this clash between the dead and the dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. And so they are the basic kind of narrative that we have going on here today is that this portion of Sylvania, this little Sylvanian settlement, was once held and controlled by, by the Blood Dragons and by one of Sir Dragoslav's thralls. He was out here managing it and, you know, you know milking the populace <laughs> um, as they do. And then one day, a, a peasant from this village arrived at Sir Dragoslav's castle, telling of a great beast that rampaged through the settlement and slew his thrall in single combat. Now, Dragoslav does not take on anybody as a thrall, and this was a noble of great power, like a, a knight of great ability and skill that was killed by this, this beast that this peasant talks of. And it's now no longer held by, by the blood dragon bloodline. And so Dragoslav has marched out in force to reclaim his land and to fight said beast. <laughs> and he has turned up to find it held by a filthy Stragoi and his lackeys. Ah, so there it is. It's a, it's a fight to retake claimed land and, and avenge the death of a thrall. Um, now, in terms of scenario, we are just playing pitched battle today. So just something nice and simple. So it's just head to head going for kill points and table quarters and banners and all the good stuff. So that is the scenario and the narrative. Let's have a look at the table. So as per usual, I have generated the terrain paces from the, the one of the tables in the back of the book um, the, from the realms of man. Um, and then we cut the table into six quadrants, six two foot quadrants generated a piece of terrain, placed it in one of those quadrants, and then scattered it 2d6 from there. And this is what we have ended up with this, this little Sylvanian hamlet out on the edges of Sylvanian territory. 
So right in the middle, we ended up with a farmstead, which in this case got turned into a, uh, thematically got turned into a graveyard. Um, Dwayne plucked it right in the middle of my quadrant here mm -hmm. and then it's scattered, boom, straight out into the middle. So look at that, we've got this big middle feature that we're fighting around. Um, a wood similarly scattered from the middle of his quadrant out to here. We've got a big lake out here. We've got a stream in the corner of mine. Um, we rolled two farmsteads and I've actually got a farmstead now. Look at this. It's a nice little little hamlet out there. Because, you know, even in Sylvania, we do still have peasants that eke out a living. You know, it is a technically still an imperial pr uh, province. So, so they're still doing stuff here, but they are under the thumb, the iron fist of the vampires. And we got a hill. Look at this. Even though I didn't need one, I still got a hill. <laughs> uh, flame me in the comments, people. <laughs> Um, so yes, that is the battlefield. Um, so both the farmstead and the graveyard will just be a full block of difficult terrain and all of the fences will be obstacles um, and everything else is what it is. So that's the battlefield. Let's have a look at deployment. So on the blood dragon side out on the far flank, we have a unit of dire wolves and then cagely kind of uh, deploying near the back here because I didn't know where he was deploying and I had far less drops so I kind of just had to hold back and and kind of plan for I don't know what. We have zombies on the left flank. We have skeletons with Grigori the Rotting and Sir Dragislav. Then we've got the big unit of Graveguard with Kaiser Blackhand and uh, King Krell the Mad. And then moving out on the right flank, we've got the Black Knights more dire wolves and the fell bats behind the stream. All right, Dwayne, can you take me through the Strigoi lines, please, sir? Let's do it. On the far left, we have five dire wolves. Just behind them, we got our unit of skeletons with hand weapons, next to a unit of 15 skeletons with spears, led by a necromancer. Mm, very good. And another Strigoi vampire. Oh, the little thrall, very yes. good. Behind the woods here in the graveyard, we got three units of six ghouls. And the right boys. next to a bat swarm. Oh boy. <laughs> Lots of bats. <laughs> Lots of bats. Just behind the bat swarm, we have our vampire lord, our general, next to our white lord, and a ton of black knights. Oh my god, yes, the general's running with the knights. Unexpected. Yes. That's a hot take right there, mate. <laughs> we'll see how that Plot works twist. out. And Indeed. then we've got our fell bats right next to them and our dire wolves on the far right. Very nice. Very nice. The lines are drawn and battle shall be had. Wahaha. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be a lot of vampire voice in this game, guys. <laughs> Lots of ha ha ha. Um, so, this is deployment, this is the battlefield, and that was the narrative. All that is left is to roll for first turn. Are you ready, Dwayne? Ready! Good man! So, because I had far less drops, I did end up dropping first. So, the Blood Dragons will be getting plus one to the roll-off. All right, Dwayne, good luck. And Godspeed! Oh! <laughs> it's, a, <laughs> it's a tie. That is a tie because of the plus one. So Amazing. We re-roll, so yeah, okay. it's a re-roll. Right. Here we go again. Oh, and oh, I take it. Very dead. good. Very good. All right. Um, hmm, do I want first turn? Or do I want you to spend a turn coming at me? Nah, you know what? I, I'm going to give it to you, sir. I'm going to give it to you. Okay. So it will be bl uh, Vampire Counts Strigoi. Turn one. Strigoi. Turn one. No charges to declare because turn one. So we go on to remaining moves. This is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. All right, Dwayne, give us your movement phase wrap up, please, sir. Everything has moved forward. Indeed it has. <laughs> <laughs> Everything, dire wolves right up here, as far as they could go, skellies, the skellies with the necromancer from the thrall. Indeed, the right flank over here, or camera right flank, mm -hmm. was unable to march because they weren't near the general. Correct. So they just moved up there four. Two units of ghouls have gone into the woods. Hiding in the woods, the other unit has just gone beside the woods. Very good. Fell bats have flown woods. from here right into this graveyard. Mm. The bat swarms have just flown up to the edge of the graveyard there, and our Strigoi-led Black Knights unit have marched up beside the graveyard. 
and our dogs have gone with in charge range of those dire wolves there. Very interesting. I don't know what you're doing with your dogs, sir, but <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know. I guess they're baiting my dogs so that you could charge <laughs> my dogs, but. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, but there it is. There it is. That is the movement phase done. So that brings us on to the first vampire phase. The magic phase. Yes, amazing. All right, Dwayne, build me your power pool, please, sir. All right, we got two base. Very we good. We got a level two wizard. Yes. And another level two wizard. Fantastic. All right, I also get the two base for being, you know, here in the old world, saturated by the winds of magic. Um, and then I have three level twos. But one of them has a power familiar, which gives me another one. So, sir, it is six to six. I equal you nice. when it comes to power and dispel. All right, Dwayne, what are you going to start with, sir? All right, Gaze of Nagash. Oh, my goodness. It's going to be cast by the Necromancer on the unit of Die Wolves. My yeah. wolves! How very dare you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sir, cast it away. How many are you using? Three dice. And what do you need? We need... Gaze and Gash needs an 8 plus. 8 plus on 3 dice. Here we go. We get Six, a 7. seven. Oh, ah, that's not a good start that for the Strigoi Necromancer. Uh, very unlucky. Very unlucky indeed, sir. Alright, what's next? Next is Curse of Years on that unit there. On this unit? Yes. Interesting. On the dogs. <laughs> on the dogs. <laughs> Hang on, hang on, hang on. Why the dogs? Why the dogs? Um, well, I, I just don't like dogs. There's juicier targets for that. For that. I like, mean, surely. you know, it's only turn one. All right, mate. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. On the dogs. Because of using the dogs. We're doing it. All right, sir. So, what do you need? Uh, we need an 11. And you get it. You get a 14. Wow. 14. Interesting. Well, that's all your dice. So. Yeah, it is all my dice. Um, I will try and oppose it. You got a 14, hey? Mm hmm. Hmm, do I think four is enough? You rolled very high. <laughs> I'll roll, I'll roll five and hope for not a double one. Yeah, yes, and in fact, no double one, no double one. It's gone, sir. It is gone. We resist Whoa. the magic of the first turn of the Strigoi. It is gone. The yeah. power was not with them. The winds were not behind them. The winds are all coming from this side, mm. <laughs> apparently, but all right. All right, sir. Well, there is no combat phase and of course, no shooting phase with vampires. So Correct. that is it. That is the end of Strigoi, turn one. Blood Dragons, turn one, charges to declare, and Dwayne has given me some. So uh, my direwolves on the right flank will charge his direwolves. And I think that's all. I, I obviously could charge those ones there, but I just don't think I want to yet. I don't think, I don't think that's what I want just now. So just the one charge and they have to hold because they're undead, mm -hmm. so. No fear checks. <laughs> so that that is that. That would bring us on to remaining moves slash move charges. So this is where everything is now. And I changed my mind. They decided to charge as well. <laughs> uh, so, so yes, they charge. But this is where everything ends up. So dire wolves on the left flank. Charge the dire wolves on the left flank. Um, uh, my, my units of infantry all did some shuffling to start focusing on the main threat of the, the general, the black knights, and kind of everything all in that one little basket over there. Um, because all of that's going to take a long time to get to the field, so I don't think I need to worry about it for a while. This is what I kind of need to worry about, for now at least. So zombies shuffled, pushed, and both of these guys just wheeled their way around, shifting the battle lines towards the great beast that they have come to kill. <laughs> um, and then right flank, the knights have clip-clopped their way forward, supporting the, the, the charge of the direwolves against direwolves, and the felbats have flown over and are now sitting in the muck of the swamp over there. <laughs> And that's it, that's it. There's no shooting phase, so we come to yet another vampire phase. So, building the power pool, we have two for being in the old world. One for Dragus Love, because he is a level two, but he generates one less power dice because he is a blood dragon. They are more about martial prowess than they are about the magiques. Um, two for Kaiser Blackhand, and then three for Grigori the Rotting, because he does have a power familiar. So, eight dice. Eight dice is what we have to start off with. It's not too shabby. I'm going to start with an Invocation of Nehek from... Uh, I'll do it from, from Kaiser, from Kaiser Blackhand, um, onto, onto this unit here, onto, onto the unit of Skeletons. 
Um, and I will just go for the three plus using two dice. And I get it on a seven, sir. Oh yes, can you build me your dispel pool, please? I've got to do that. Right there. Four, <laughs> one hole. Two for showing up and one for each level two. Beautiful. All right, sir, I have rolled a seven for an invocation of Nehek. Do you want to, to oppose dispel. me? Very good. Using two dice, opposing the seven. No! no that oh, that's rough. That's rough. So we are getting D6 skeletons to the unit for two. An extra two skeletons. I'll just mark them there for now. Lovely. All right. The first spell goes off for a couple of extra skellies. Um, let's run it back. Let's do it again. This time, Grigori is going to target the unit with an invocation of a heck. Nehek. Again, just two dice. Going for the three up. Ha! Oh. And I get it on a seven again, sir. Would you like to oppose me? Let's try. Very good. <laughs> no, he doesn't. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> Things are going rough for the Strigoi. And I get another four. So that will be a total of six skeletons getting added to the unit. Amazing. Very nice. Um, leaving me with four dice remaining. Hmm. Um, I will throw three dice at, at Hellish Vigor from Grigori onto my dire wolves to allow them to re-roll missed attacks in, the, in this round of combat. Um, so here we go, using three dice, looking for a seven plus for hellish vigor. And I yes, do it. get it, I get it, the vigor is hellish. Amazing, there they are. Um, I'll check that range in just a sec. Actually, could you check that for me? Looks like they are. Yes, yep. yes, in range. So they will be re-rolling attacks, lovely. Um, and I've got one dice left. I'll just go for one more Invocation of Nehek. Um, and this is from Sudragus Love himself onto the unit. Just looking for a three plus. Yeah, Dragus Love gets it. Another D6 skeletons for Ooh. six. Whoa, Dragus Love. So 12 skeletons coming to that unit. Very nice. Amazing, let's get those skeletons on the field. And there it is, the unit swollen by the unholy powers of the Necromancers and Dragus Love. Oh boy, she's a big unit now. I actually only own another four skeletons, so it's not going to be getting that much bigger, but there it is. A lot of skellies. Woo. <laughs> um, all right, that is the end of the magic phase. That does bring us to the combat phase. And we've got a couple of them. Um, we'll leave that one till last because that one's got the, the cool spell attached to it. So let's come over to the right flank. So here we are, right flank. It's dogs versus dogs. This is high level play, people. <laughs> <laughs> Here it is. Mm. All right, so we have five dire wolves and one of them is a doom wolf. So this will be six attacks coming in. We are equal in martial prowess in weapon skill, so we are hitting on fours. Ooh, we only get two. That's not a good start. Um, we have slavering charge, so strength four. Um, uh, two toughness, three. So wounding slash killing on threes. Nah, I kill one. Damn. Nice. <laughs> damn and double damn. All right, <laughs> sir, you can strike back. Cool. So we got f how many? Two, four. Oh, no. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Attacks five back. attacks coming back cool. in, sir. Hitting on fours. On fours. Let's do it, boys. Let's not one. do it. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> one yeah. is not the best. All right. Let's uh, see but if we can match you in wounds. Indeed. Eh? Wounding but on fours, sir. Fours. Oh, no, no, no wound, bugger. All right, sir. So, so that just means one. by two because I outnumber you now oh, as well. Yeah, so yeah. two dogs do crumble, my that friend. Is so sad. Oh, so sad. The poor dogs. Poor doggies. <laughs> All right, very good. And now over to the left flank. Again, it is dogs versus dog. New sculpt versus old sculpt. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and again, we're doing it again. It is going to be six attacks, five wolves, and a doom wolf. Um, we are again hitting on fours. That. <laughs> um, I'm going to take that as a two. The two looks like the most, so okay. miss. Um, uh, so we got three hits, a statistical roll, but we do have hellish vigor on this Ooh. unit, so we re-roll misses. Very good, converting hit. one extra. And again, slavering charge gives them plus one strength on the charge. Strength four to toughness three, killing on threes. Oh, wow, we just wiped wow. four of them, <laughs> sir. Okay, so it's just Ugh. the Doom Wolf remaining. Yep. Oh boy, should have thrown an attack into the Doom Wolf. All right, <laughs> Doom Wolf can attack back, sir. Two there attacks on fours, one of them, one and wounding on fours. Killing on fours? Yeah, he you do it. kill a dog in return, but he does crumble, he does crumble to the away. combat res. Um, 
which means that I can overrun, which is pretty cool. Mm. So we will, we are gonna overrun 2d6 straight forward into the back lines. Yeah, four inches, but. <laughs> All right, and that is where they end up. Their four inch overrun didn't, didn't quite make the distance that I was hoping for there, but such is life. Um, cool, we won the dog fights. <laughs> so one of them, one of them solidly and one of them not Almost. quite solidly. <laughs> All right, but that is it. That is the end of Blood Dragons, turn one. Strigoi, turn two. Charges to declare? Zero. Zero. Zero Very charges. good, sir. Very good. So that brings us to remaining moves. This is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. All right, Dwayne, give me your wrap up, my man. All right. So skeletons here have moved forward, sort of wheeled towards those fell bats there. Mm -hmm. This rank has just moved up forward closer. Interesting. Preparing to take on the knights head on. Correct. Spicy. Our ghouls have come out of the woods. Uh, these have gone beside the graveyard. We've got two units in the graveyard. Yes, in their happy place. <laughs> yes, feasting on bodies as they go. <laughs> Indeed, digging up some graves while they're in there. <laughs> Bat Swarm has flown into the graveyard as well. Indeed. Flying around everywhere. And then we've got our um, solid unit here. It's just moved up here to get ready to face Dragislav. Ooh, yes, the hammer and the anvil. They are all of the eggs in the one basket. Yeah. <laughs> Over here on the left flank, coming to fight the army. <laughs> We'll see how that goes. Um, cool, that is it. That's the movement phase done. It's it's getting messy. It's getting interesting. Um, I don't like this at all. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, the fell bats. Fell yeah, bats. They flew right out there. Indeed, yeah, right, right to the butt unit. of my grave guard. Yep. Un, un, I don't like it. <laughs> <laughs> Very uncouth. Um, all right, it's magic phase again, mate. Yeah. You've still got your six. I've still mm -hmm. got my six. Okay. What are you gonna cast? We are going to cast Curse of Years, of oh course. Boy. And it's going on Dragoslav's unit. Ooh, on the unit of skeletons. Yes, here we go. All right, what do you need for a Curse of Years? It's like a 10 or an 11? Uh, we need, actually it's not going on the unit of skeletons. We're oh. gonna put it in that unit there. Onto the, the, the grave guard. guard. Onto yep. the whites. The Very guard. good, sir. Yes, I think that's the way to go. And so what's this cast on? This is cast on 11, uh, 10 plus. A 10, 10 plus. plus. Yeah, my bad, not 11. Very 10. good, using three dice. Three dice, come on. Here we go. Malakas. He doesn't no, get it. No, he doesn't get it. Oh, my luck. Oh, that is bad magic. Bad magic. Bad um, magic indeed, sir. And our then... next trick is going to be Gaze of Nagash on this unit. Oh, on the knights. Mm, Very good, Okay, sir. so this is on a seven... Eight plus. Eight plus. Eight plus. Come on. Gaze at the knights with intent. We've done it. Always done it. Would you like with to a, dispel? What is that, a 12? 9, 10, 11, 12, yep. Yeah, it's a 12. I will try to dispel, Ooh. sir. I'll use four dice. Okay. Get out of here. He's sure it. enough, on a double <laughs> six. <laughs> Get out of here with uh, your magic. He you won't let me cast We the are the masters of necromancy. <laughs> <laughs> ah, bugger. Yeah. Um, all right, and that's it? Uh, that is, yeah, that is it, yep. Yeah? Um, yeah, yep. Yeah, you sure? For magic, yeah. All right. That's all I can do. <laughs> cool. Well, I will remind you, sir, you do have the Book of Arcan. Oh, yes, yeah. I do. Mm, the problem is, they're alive. Ah, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so not going to work uh, for those boys. No, it'll work for anything us. else. Yeah, okay, why not? We'll do it. Yeah? Yeah, we'll use the Book of Arcan. Who are you going to cast it on? Who am I going to cast it on? Good. Good yeah. question. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, like, by, by reminding you, I wasn't saying there's a good thing to do with it right now. <laughs> but I just wanted to remind you that you had it. <laughs> uh, up. All right, yeah, let's do it. We'll cast it on, um, we'll cast it on these skeletons here. Targeting those move. skeletons with yep. the Book of Arcan. Um, power level four, I think it was. Ah, uh, three. It's three. a power level uh, three, sir. So she's easy to get rid of. Yeah. I'll just throw two dice at her. She'll be like, no, thank you. Yep, and sure no. enough, it goes away. <laughs> it's gone. Um, now, you do need to roll a dice, sir. And on a one, it is exhausted for oh, the game. Yeah, that's right. So every time you use it. Oh, oh, yeah, no, this is the worst luck I've had with magic. Oh my goodness. Brutal. Yeah, oh my brutal. god. That's just yep. The Book of Arcan is gone. He no longer holds the book. It crumbles to dust in his hands. <laughs> Got dispelled and then just crumbled to Mate, dust. Mate, Jesus. That was rough. That, that was, was rough. rough, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, damn. All right, well, that ends Strigoi, turn two. <laughs> Jokes, we have a combat over here. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about the direwolves. So yes, um, so because I won the last combat, I do get to go first. Um, so it looks like I get three. 
Looks like I get three dogs in combat. Um, so, and one of them is the Doom Wolf. So it's going to be four attacks. Hitting on fours. All very good. A nice, nice statistical average roll there. Getting two hits and wounding on fours. Ah, and we just finished them, mate. Black. The Go two on. dogs get munched down. The dog v dog battle is done. <laughs> and huzzah, it is, it is my dogs that win. You can overrun now, can't you? Ah, uh, no, that has to be in the first round. Oh, on the right, first yeah. round and on, on the, the charge. charge. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Indeed. Cool. So, mm -hmm. all right, that is the end of Strigoi. Turn two. Blood Dragons, turn two. Charges to declare, and I do have a couple. We have the right flank units, we're doing it, we're double charging. So the, uh, the, the Blood Dragon Black Knights are going to charge the front of the unit and the dogs are going to swing, boom, into the flank. Um, we have to hold because we're undead, so that is just the charges done. No other charges, so that brings us on to move charges slash remaining moves. So. This is where everything is now, and this is where everything ends up. All right, the battle lines have continued to shift somewhat towards the knights. Uh, my unit of skeletons and graveguard have just wheeled and pushed, only having four inches to work with this time because of the flat, flat bats within eight. Um, we have the dire wolves at the back after chewing up their, their, their compatriots on the other side, have swung around behind the black knights, the, the uh, zombies truffle shuffled to the side slightly and move forward a little bit. And then over on the right flank, we have uh, the, the, the gang bang, <laughs> <laughs> the, the savage charge to the front and rear, and the flap flap bats have just gone out to the back because I don't have a purpose for them. So, <laughs> so they're just out there looking relevant. Um, and that's it. That is the movement phase done. So let's go to the magic phase. So let's do it. I've still got my eight dice. I am going to start by targeting this unit with another Invocation of Nehek. Um, and this will start from Kaiser Blackhand. We'll target the unit uh, just on a three plus using 2d6. I get it on a seven, sir. I'll try and dispel with you. Very good. Hey, he does it. it. He does it at last. Finally. Amazing. <laughs> Very good, sir. Ooh. Yeah. A moment of glory. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> a moment of magical glory. <laughs> um, very good. I will, I'll do it again, but this time from Grigori the Rotting onto mm -hmm. the unit. Same again. Get it on an eight this time, sir. Mm, I won't dispel that. Very good. D6 skeletons. Four. That's the exact amount of skeletons I have left. <laughs> <laughs> the unit is at its most glorious size. <laughs> Amazing. Huzzah. <laughs> um, fantastic. And then I will um, I will target the unit of zombies with uh, with uh, Kaiser. No, sorry, with Dragis Love. Dragis Love von Kurz. And he's going to use three dice. Using three dice, going on the seven plus, looking at four, um, looking for 2d6 zombies. So, using three dice, here we go, yeah! Ooh, oh, yeah, no, that's a one. So, four, five, six, seven, blah, that's it, that's what I needed. Yeah, cool. Yeah, uh, amazing, do you want to, do you want to dispel it? Um, hmm, uh, yeah, sure, yep, we'll dispel. Two dice, looking to equal a seven. No, 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 no. very good. So 2d6 plus two zombies coming to that unit. Ah, oh, for another 10, amazing. Uh, amazing. Very nice. 10 zombies entering the unit. And um, that leaves me with one dice left. I don't think I have a purpose for it. No, I don't, I've got nothing to do with it. So I'll just, I'll keep it. Cool. Oh, I wish I had the black peri up yeah, right now. I could yeah. have stored it. Uh -huh. um, and at this stage, I will use my Book of Arcane. Mm, <laughs> um, nice. uh, to just, yeah, I don't know. I guess I'll target this unit just to just to move it a bit. Cool. So um, I'll just do the roll now. Do does the book get expunged? It doesn't. doesn't. Fabulous, <laughs> lucky Christos. <laughs> um, so I'll. Uh, I must have I'll, had the fake version of the book. Yeah, you must have exactly. <laughs> You're the imposter. I'm the real necromancer, <laughs> the real Kaiser. You guys' name's like Pfizer or something. <laughs> Um, so I'll, I'll move the unit, I'll bring out some extra models. All right, and there is my extra 10 zombies added to that unit, and this unit has swung its way around, just kind of matching the battle line with the skeletons. I've got a lot of models on the board now. <laughs> I think you started with a model advantage. 
Yep. We may have equaled slash I may have surpassed. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of models. Um, all right, that's it. That's the magic phase done. We're going on to a Let's. combat phase. And here it is. Here it is. The Black Knights have come thundering in with a charge, tooting their little horn. I don't know how a skeleton plays a horn. I kind of imagine they just kind of like hold it into the wind as they're charging. <laughs> <laughs> But there they go, they've slammed into the front with the direwolves swinging into the flank. This is our chance to, to put an end to some, some nasty, nasty peeps. I'm really worried about that thrall, but you know, hopefully I can kill a necromancer. That'd be sweet. <laughs> That'd be, make it all worth it. Um, so because I did the charging, I get the option of declaring a challenge and my, my black knight, my hell knight, will declare a challenge, sir. Will you accept? Yeah, it's, yeah, Necromancer will have to accept that. The Necromancer's accepting the challenge? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Savage. <laughs> you send him to the butcher's bill? Yep. Very good. Amazing. All right, so it's Necromancer versus Hell Knight. <laughs> oh, poor little Necromancer. <laughs> but look, he might survive this. He could you just be know. fine. He might be the hero that you need but don't deserve. <laughs> <laughs> so it's challenge first. Let's do it. The Hell Knight goes first because mm -hmm. he charged. He has two attacks at weapon skill three. Necromancer also has weapon skill three. So we are and hitting fours. on fours. Oh, oh, we missed. No, God damn it. You still got your horse though, right? Got a horse. Of course, the horse. The hits. horse always Boo. Hits. And wounding on fours, the horse wounds. He takes a wound. Amazing. Oh God, how many wounds? He's got do you two. Have? He's got, He's got two, two, mate. Okay. So pop a little wound dice next to him, but All he right. does survive it and survives to attack me back. He does. So go on, mate. Swing away. I think he only has one attack, doesn't he? He yep, does. He's yep. only got one attack. He'll hit on fours. He no. misses. Very good. <laughs> um, all right. And so then the rest of my attacks will come through. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to put... Uh, how many wounds does he have? He's got three, he's yeah? He's got three. Yep, Damn three it. wounds. I don't think I can kill him. <laughs> but oh, no, he's only got two. He's only got two he's wounds. Only got two wounds. Well, yeah. I'm gonna have to try. Yeah. I'm gonna put I'm gonna put two knights into him. Okay. Um, and then uh, what's what's his weapon skill? Seven. Oh. Right? Uh, no, six. Yeah, six. Weapon skill six? Mm -hmm. Alright, not more than double, so that means I won't be hitting on fives. So that's good. So two knights are gonna go into him, yep. and then the remaining uh, three just into the unit. Mm -hmm. So let's do the two knights. Swing into the vampire thrall. They lower their lances. They come galloping in. They hit on fours. Ah, one of them one hits. Hit. One lance finds purchase in flesh. He's toughness five? Toughness. No, maybe just toughness four for a thrall. Toughness four, yeah. Toughness four, mm -hmm. strength six with a lance, wounding on twos. We do wound oh, him, sir. He has that's a killing blow. <gasps> that is killing blow! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, oh no, oh, oh. he has a ward save. Oh, he does have a ward he save. He comes stuck oh. with a six up ward save, sir. Six up, live or die. Oh, <laughs> oh my god! Oh my he does god! It. <laughs> he does it. Amazing! Oh, oh finally dude. a bit of luck. That's Friggin amazing. Hell. Look yes. at that. Yeah, six to a six, dude. <laughs> So good. Oh. I mean, really bad for me, but that was great. Ah, oh, that's Warhammer, baby. Ward that's save. that's the good stuff right there. Six up ward save. <laughs> oh, clutch. So clutch. All right, two horses are going to kill him though. Don't you worry. One of them hits. One of them wounds oh, him, mate. Is six up ward save. Oh, jeez. Can you do it again? Yes. <laughs> oh, what the hell? What? Oh. Ridiculous. Ridiculous, oh. mate. That's, you know, Tables once was great. Now, that was that was ridiculous. That was, yeah. <laughs> once that. Uh, All wow. right. The remaining black knights Jeez. into the skeletons, hitting them on the threes. Very good. And twos to crush them. Very good. Two mm. of them do go down, sir. Okay. Because um, they've just got shields. Yeah, just yeah, shields. Yeah, yeah. So two go down. Um, and then three horses also into the skeletons on fours. Oh, very good. And fours. Ah, uh, two, mate. Two six ups for the shields. That's um, the horses? The horses, yeah, yes. Cool. Two six ups. Let's do it. No, no. we do kill two skeletons. All right. Very good. Um, all right. And then I've got dire wolves, mate. Mm -hmm. So one of them didn't make it into combat. So okay. there will be four dire wolves and a doom wolf. And a doom wolf. Yeah. So five attacks. Um, are these guys a weapon skill three? Um, do I put anything into the thrall? 
do uh, he's taken no wounds. I can't believe he's taken no yeah, wounds. That is six up ridiculously one lucky. Ooh. Nah, I don't think I bother. I think I'll just put everything into the skeletons. So Money. five attacks hitting on threes. Ooh, we missed one. Pretty good. Okay. Slavering charge means killing on threes. Oh, too, too sad. But two skeletons do go down, sir. Mm. Okay. Very nice. All right, so now you get to attack back. This okay, is the moment well, I was dreading. <laughs> five skellies are dead, so I've only got the necromancer who was already attacked. Ah, so hang on, so five, um, two from the flank are dead. Okay. So and you had one, so you'd have one in the flank that could potentially attack back if okay. that's the way you wanted to throw him. Mm -hmm. And so how many from the front died? Four from the front died. So, so four from the front, so, so you got four guys to attack, one of which could go to the side. The three have to go to the front. Okay, so three in the front. Let's All right, do so that. three from the second rank going mm -hmm. into the front of the knights. Here we go. Getting a single hit and wounding on fives. No, no wound. No uh, one from the flank into the dogs. One from the flank. Let's do that. Hits. He does it. Wounding on fours. No. no All right, so the skeletons do nothing. Okay. Um, but now it's the big yes. boy. Here now it's the big boy. One of the black knights. So oh got boy. Four attacks, is it? It is. Yep, four attacks. Four attacks. Weapon skill of six. Very good to weapon cool. skill three. Hitting on threes. No, he misses one, but misses one, he does but he have does infinite hatred, hatred. Yes, indeed. Ah, oh, still misses me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's strength six because he's got something sinews. Yep, iron sinews. Iron sinews, yes. amazing. Toughness four, wounding on twos, mate. Let me yeah. see some ones here. <laughs> oh, you did roll one. All right, we one, one. So two, two wounds, wounds come through. Mm -hmm. They've got two, arm, two up armor saves, negative by three. Gives mm -hmm. them five up armor saves. Up armor saves. I'd like to make one here. Hell, I'd like to make two. I do make it one. Make one okay. Very good. So one black knight does fall to the, the claws of the, the thrall. Mm. All right, sir. Let's have a look at some combat res. So I killed six skeletons. Is that right? One, two, three. Yep. Six. Two, four, six. And I wounded your necromancer. Mm -hmm. um, I have a flank charge mm -hmm. and I outnumber. Oh, you do? Um, so, yep, these guys are worth 10. Um, mm and 10, so that's 20 to your right. 11 yeah, yeah. or something. Okay. Seven wounds, outnumber, banner, and a flank charge. Um, you got one wound in return. Yep. You have a banner, and that is that it, is my it. friend. So you are crumbling by two, four, six, eight. Oh, ouch, so that's five, six, Ooh. Seven. Musician's gone. Musician's Eight. gone, but the banner remains. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we didn't manage to kill them on the charge and break them. That's a big Almost. deal. That's a big deal. Um, now, can, can I lap around? Is that something I can do? So everywhere I can find that talks about lapping around, it always just mentions units from rear ranks can lap around. So. In this case, I have no rear ranks, so it seems like these guys couldn't. Um, let me know in the comments how this should work. You know, should we redress this so that I have the maximum amount of guys in combat? Is the formation stuck like this? You know, should these guys move across so that there's more or move that way and these guys shuffle here? Or is it just stuck? Because I don't have the answer, I'm just gonna leave it like this and assume that the front rank can't lap around. But put it in the comments for me guys and put a page number for the reference. Whether it's from a chronicle, whatever it happens to be. Let me know how you would deal with this situation. All right, and there it is. We, we won the combat solidly, but we didn't break them. Um, that, that vampire thrall obviously has incredible reflexes darting out of the way of these, these weapons with his six up ward saves. Amazing, <laughs> that was awesome. Super, super cool. But that is it. That is the end of Blood Dragons, turn two. Strigoi, turn three. Charges to declare, and we've got some? We do. Very we good. We do, we got a few. Tell so me about it. We're gonna go with these skeletons into the flank of the direwolves. Very nice. Uh, these ghouls here, we're gonna turn around and flank charge the um, black knights. There. Very good. This unit of ghouls are gonna charge the flank of the grave guard, Hell while yeah. the fell bats charge them up the butt. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> right up my <Majaxi. laughs> Very good. All right, so we're getting flanks and rears all over the place, and those are all the charges. They, uh, yep, that's everything. Fantastic, sir. So that brings us to move charges slash remaining moves. 
This is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. All right, Dwayne, give us your wrap up, mate. All right, so skellies have charged into the side of the dogs. Indeed. Ghouls have charged out into the side of the Black Knights. Yes. Our fell bats have charged the rear of the Grave Guard. Our ghouls have charged the flank of the Grave Guard. Mm -hmm. our, um, our bat swarm has moved just to the edge of the grave, uh, graveyard there. Mm -hmm. um, ghouls have come out of the graveyard. Everyone's ditching the graveyard. <laughs> Get out of the graveyard time, boys. <laughs> And this movement has not moved. Uh, this unit has not moved. Interesting. They've just, just sat right there. still. They're, they're Waiting. not liking the jaws of this trap. <laughs> a deep breath before the plunge. Oh, very good. All right, that's movement phase done. Yep. The, the charging units got there and the, the couple of other units moved around a bit. So let's magic phase again, sir. You've nice. still got your six dice mm -hmm. and I've still got my six dice. So our first trick, we're going to use the power stone. Ooh. with our necromancer so it gives it an extra two dice very nice so yeah let's do that so hang on i'll just use them so yeah got three left and what's he what's he casting he is casting invocation of nehek 11 plus invocation of nehek yes oh of course yep. on the, the skeleton unit yes he's gonna fill out the unit again very good sir 11 plus let's go oh no oh no oh, that's a miscast that's a miscast <laughs> no Dwayne. I can't cast spells this game. Okay, so miscast table. Brutal. It was brutal. Mate. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Uh, Let's okay. consult the table. All right. Let's see it, mate. Okay, so. Good luck and Godspeed. Six or seven, please. Let's take a look. <laughs> no, of course not. Ten? It's ten. The caster is racked by sorceress power and suffers one wound with no saves of that. Oh, it kills He's him. Dead. It kills him. <laughs> He tried, oh, he, he consumes the power stone when it just uh, like racks his body with uncontrollable energy and just You know, I painted him too. Oh. He was supposed to stop miscasting. <laughs> <laughs> it's the curse uh, of the freshly painted model. <laughs> yes, it is. I think it is. Oh, mate. Oh, oh thus, lucky. Thus ends lucky. him. Um, it doesn't end the magic phase, It does doesn't, it? so I still have three dice still left. Still got three dice yeah. left and one caster left to cast. Oh, okay. It's going to have to be Curse of Years mm. on Dragoslav's unit. On the unit yeah. of... All right, yeah. mate. That's what we're doing. Very good. You've got right. three dice I've to only cast three. it. <laughs> three <laughs> dice, come on. Double six. Oh, oh you do get it. Six. You get twelve. it on a, yeah. on a 12. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, look, I'll oppose it. Of course. Of course I will. Um... Four dice? Hell, I'll use five. Get out of here. Uh, ooh, I don't even know if I got that. Six, seven, eight, nine. Oh. <laughs> Wait, no, sorry. That's nine, 10, 11, 12. Oh, no. you do. You <laughs> match it. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't count. Um. No. Ah, we match it and we stop the magic. Not a single spell Not for the string So Nothing. rough. Um, all right, mate. Well, that brings us to the combat phase. Yep. Where go. do you want to start? Do you want to start with this one or the, the we'll big messy one? one. Eh? Yeah, big we'll go messy this one. one. Yep. Um, all right, mate. Well, so I think the vampire attacks first. Well, it comes back to declare charges. Uh, sorry, mm. uh, declare challenges again because oh, the challenge okay. ended yep. with <laughs> with that poor, poor imposter yes. necromancer uh -huh. popping himself. Yep. Um, so it is your phase. Do you want to declare a challenge? Uh, no. <laughs> I You will do. declare a challenge, yes. yes. Of course okay. I will, yep. sir. I need I'll to save to my it. unit. Indeed I you will. I do need to accept it. Uh, so, yep, you will be striking first, of course. So, right. hitting on threes. All oh, right, out. I'll re-roll them. Re-rolling for infinite hatred. Oh. Wow, very good getting three of them, babe. Okay. Strength six, so wounding on twos. twos. He's gone. There we go. He gets three wounds. Oh, I will does. have three yep. five-up um, armor saves. saves. Yep. Correct. Can I make all of them? <laughs> I'd like to make some of them, so I don't give you a whole lot of, a whole lot of overkill here. So come on. Five-ups! I make one, but mm. two do go through. So he does go down, and he will be worth one point of okay. overkill. Nicely done. All right, sir. Um, uh, that's the challenge done. Yep. Then we would go with the charging units. Yes. So well, let's do the ghouls, eh? The ghouls? Fabulous. Have we got two, four, six, eight, nine Indeed. for the ghast. Nine for the ghast. Yes, four ghouls made it into combat. Mm -hmm. So nine attacks. Here we go. All right. All right. Ghouls are weapon skill three. So hitting weapon, yep. on threes. Oh, sorry, fours. 
Oh, oh we got some auto wounds. Mate, you got a ton of auto yeah. wounds for poison. Very nice. Amazing. And one regular hit. Cool. So these are wounds. That one will wound on a five. No. Oh. But four wounds come through. That's cool. pretty spicy. Um, we have two up armor saves. Hurrah! Ah, oh. we save them all. They all clink them. off the barding and the heavy plate mail. The old bronze patinaed mail keeps them safe. Amazing. Very nice. Um, and then the skeletons. The skeletons. So yeah, one, two, three, four. They have a champion. So five attacks. Five attacks into the flank of the dogs. Alrighty, here we go. Hitting on fours. No. Two, two hits. hits. Very good. Okay. Two hits. Wounding on fours. Ah, oh, oh, very nice. Wounds. You do kill two dogs. Two. That's pretty solid. Very nice, sir. Um, all right. And then it would be, I guess, me because he is all that's left, mm -hmm. but he would go after me because I won the last yes, round of combat. Correct. Um, all right, cool. Well, all right, well, I can put two attacks into the, the skeleton unit. Okay. Um, and I can put one attack into them. Cool. And I think that's it. You killed the one guy that could attack over there. Yeah. Ooh, this isn't good. <laughs> this isn't good at all. Um, so... Let's do the two into into the skeleton standard bearer on fours, threes, on threes. Very good, one hit. And threes. We do get him, mate. The standard bearer He's goes gone. down and the unit with it. Um, and then the one black knight going across into the ghouls, yep. hitting on fours, hitting, mm -hmm. wounding on fours, kills a ghoul. Dead. And then the horse hits. Winning on fives, no wound. Hmm. Um, oof, all right. Well, let's have a look-see. So, you, let's do you. You did four wounds, two with the skeletons and two in the challenge. Mm -hmm. um, you have a flank charge and you have a single rank and a banner. Um, I, I did Two this, um, this doesn't count as a flank charge too? Uh, so you only ever get to count one flank charge. Uh, so even if you've got multiple, you only get one, one combat okay. res for it. Right. So, so I got two wounds, did I? Uh, did I so you killed kill? the ghoul and, and the skeleton. you killed the skeleton. Yeah, so yeah. two wounds. Um, I also have a flank charge mm -hmm. and a banner. Yep. And who outnumbers who? I think you're outnumbering me at this point. Oof. You outnumber. <laughs> All right. All right, sir. So it looks like I crumble by four. Oh boy. Um, now, does every unit crumble by yeah, four? Yeah, every ah. unit. They're all gone, so they dude. all go. Ouch. Very nice, mate. The the big swing back. Oh, jeez. That those skeletons entering the fray when they did made a big I difference. Think so. All right, and the flank is won by the Strigoi thrall with the with the the aid of some skeletons, a timely charge. So, oof, that was pretty good, pretty rough for me, but that that's how she goes. That's how the skeletons crumble. <laughs> but um, so we're over here. We're over to the the. The flap flap fell bats and the ghouls slamming into the flank of the whites. So, do you want to declare a challenge with your unit champion of the ghouls? Oh. <laughs> um, oh, I don't think I will. Well, King King Cranon the Mad will declare a challenge. Okay. Sir. Yep. Uh, yeah, all well, right. We will have to accept. You'll accept? Yeah, yeah um, you, you have to. He's got to, nowhere yeah. to hide. So, <laughs> That's right. Cranon will be fighting the, okay. uh, the, the cool, ghoul. Cool. Mm -hmm. um, uh, lovely. And then let's do that first. So, Sweet. the ghoul will go first because he charged. Okay. Cool. So, Elgasti with three attacks. Yep, three attacks. Hitting let's do that. on fours. Let's get rid of these. Ooh, two hits, oh, okay. but no two auto hits. wounds. No. Uh, wounding on fives for strength three to toughness four. Oh, oh <laughs> snake eyes. <laughs> oh boy. Uh. All right. Old Cranon has three attacks and he's going to be hitting on threes for the Banner of the Barrows. He gets two hits. Very he's nice. strength four to toughness four. four so yeah. wounding on fours, mm -hmm. but any fives are just killing blow. Oh. And he does. Oh. He killing blows he's him. Gone. Indeed. Puts down the ghast. All right, sir, you can go with the rest of your ghouls into All the right, unit. Cool. So that is, what, two, four, six, so, eight? Is it? I guess you could have moved 
the the ghast to here so yep that sure. will give you a remaining four so, cool. so eight, eight attacks very nice eight attacks looking for fours wait uh, oh. no there wasn't sixes. still three so fours fours looking for sixes really. looking for sixes getting one okay one auto cool. wound there we go. and then three other at three other hits a lot of ones. Indeed. Wounding on fives. I don't know, so just put the put one of those down. Oh, yep. One of those okay, is an yep, auto yep. wound. Mm. Yep. Beautiful. Looking for fives. Another wound okay, is converted. Cool. Two wounds. Two wounds come through. We have three up armor saves for heavy armor, hand weapon, and shield. Ha! Oh. Oh, we save one, but a grave guard does go down mm. to the slavering claws of a ghoul. Very nice. Cool. Um, and then all your fell bats, fell mate. Bats. So, so two, two four, four, six, eight, ten. Ten, ten attacks, attacks from the, the fellest of bats. Come on, fell bats have got weapon skill three. Hitting on fours. Okay. Terrible. Um, definitely not the best. Looks like three. Yep. <laughs> oh, man. Three out of ten. That's uh, out. That's not average. <laughs> yep. <laughs> all right. And then wounding on fives, mate. Oh, that he gets get one. one. He does okay. get one. Three up armor save. Yep, we save it. It clangs off the ancient plate mail. Oh. Um, all right, let's get some attacks back. All right, so you've killed one from the flank, so uh, that would allow me to put potentially three. I'm just going to put two so I can put max attacks back into cool. the bats. So yeah. two into the ghouls, hitting on threes. Ooh. And fours. Ah, we get a killing blow. Ooh. We lop off a ghoul's head. Amazing. Would have been dead either way, but yeah. killing blow. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then six attacks into the rear at the bats. Six of these boys turn and start swinging at the flailing bats, hitting on threes. Oh, wow. Yeah, okay. Doing all right here. And wounding on threes. Um, ooh, no killing blows and just two wounds. So we kill a single bat at the back. Mm. One bat goes down. All right. Um, all right, sir, let's have a look at some combat res. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not going to be great. No. Um, so let's do me. I killed a ghoul. I killed two ghouls mm -hmm. um, and a bat, which mm -hmm. was two wounds. Two wounds yeah. um, I've got three ranks. Now, just before anybody starts talking about my ranks getting negated. So skirmishes and flying skirmishes do not negate ranks mm. when they hit flanks or rears. So right. I'm still getting full ranks here from this. So I got my three ranks. I've got a banner and I am outnumbering. Ooh. So, and then you killed a grave guard. You got a flank charge and a rear charge. And oh. I think that's it. One, two, three, four, five. So we are winning by five. So the bats crumble by five. So two of them go down. One has and one, one, wound has one wound remaining, exactly. The and ghouls. these here ghouls need to take a leadership they test. Now, pants. the boss is nearby. So they will be able to get his oh, leadership okay. of nine. That's cool. But minus five, yeah. Yeah. So that is going to be four. Yes, leadership right. four for those ghouls. Come Can on, they ghouls, stay? Let's do it, Rollo. No, no, they're out of here. They're so they are going to break and run. How far do they run? Let's have a look. Oop, whoa. They're going to run nine. Nine inches. Away away. Yes, indeed. Right here on the edge of the graveyard. Fabulous. Graveyard. <laughs> let's get them moved. And that is where the fleeing ghouls end up, just on the other side of the graveyard. Um, and this is what remains of the fell bats in the rear of the grave guard. So that is it. That is it. You, you won the right flank nicely. Um, uh, that was pretty great. Um, and over here, I don't know, I think that went about as well as could be expected. Mm -hmm. um, so that's it. That is it. That is the end of Strigoi, turn three. Blood Dragons, turn three. No charges to declare. I considered throwing my fell bats into, into the thrall. Um, at most, I could put th four attacks, four strength three attacks into him. You know, hitting on fours, wounding on fives. Probably, actually, strength three, and he's tough. No, he's on the toughness four, so wounding on fives. So I don't think I do the two wounds to him. Um, and he probably just kills the bats, and I throw away 60 points. So not charging the bats in. And um, still, it's still not time to charge the dogs in yet because they're just charging in by themselves, not doing a whole lot. I mean, I suppose it would slow down the knights, but the knights aren't going anywhere. So no, no charges, <laughs> <laughs> no charges. Old so, position. Yes, indeed. So that brings us to remaining moves. So uh, this is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. 
All right, the uh, dogs in the back, the, uh, the, the dire wolves have just backed up a bit, just making sure they're staying out of charge range of those ghouls, um, but staying in charge range of the knights. Um, we've decided that you're not coming into the trap, <laughs> so we're coming to you, right? Um, both these units have just wheeled and pushed as much as they could with their four inches because they were both much blocked. Um, and then over on the right flank, my, my flap flap fell bats have just flap flapped whoosh over to this side of those units. Um, they remain to not have a purpose. <laughs> so, so that's that. All right. So we go into another magic phase and let's see if we can get some stuff going on. So we are going to start with a Van Hell's Dance Macabre. We are going to throw three dice at it um, and we're going to do it from um, from this gentleman, from, from who's that? Kaiser, from Kaiser Blackhand onto the zombies. Looking for a nine plus, three dice, yeah. We do get it, sir, we get it on a 10. Hmm. Uh, I'll, I'll let it go off. You'll let it go, yep. fabulous. It's going to be an eight inch move for these zombies. Zombies ending up right here after their, their Van Hell's Dance getting, you know, pushed on with unholy vigor. They suddenly come quick step in their way forward, swinging around and out. Um, all right, what's next? I have still got five power dice. I'm going to cast Van Hell's Dance Macabre again, this time from Sir Dragoslav himself onto his own unit. Mm. Um, and again, looking for a nine plus. Oh, and I do get it, mate, on a 12. Hmm. I'll let you have that one. Ooh, you let me have it. Amazing. All right, and after a lot of umming and ahhing, I decided to use that 8-inch move to charge the Bat Swarm. Yes. Ah, uh, who saw that coming? Nobody. <laughs> <laughs> but at this point, because of where this last one was, I couldn't actually get past it without coming within an inch of it, so it was blocking my path and guaranteed it was probably going to end up charging me sometime soon. So I figured I'd just charge it and get the process of killing a whole bunch of shitty bats done. <laughs> <laughs> so, so there begins the process. Um, and that leaves me with two dice remaining. Two dice remaining and I will target um, the zombies with an invocation of Nahek. Um, and I'm going to go for the seven plus. Seven plus um, and this is from who hasn't invoked? I'm not sure. Who invoked so far? He definitely did. Mm -hmm. I think I've only done one. Okay, so I'll do it from Grigori. Grigori will invoke, invoke the heck. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> on this unit, looking for a seven plus. Gets it on a seven, mate. We are dispelling. Very good. Three dice. And you do, you do dispel it. Well done, Very so nice. you hold back the magic. Now, <sighs> it does leave me with my bound item. So I could use it. I could use my bound item to, to get my zombies in right mm, now. True. Or to get my, my, my dire wolves into the rear. I don't know if it's worth it. I don't know if it's worth putting the zombies in there now. I mean, it means that you don't get to charge with all of your nasty knights. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's right. Oh, no. oh, you know what? I'm doing it. I can't be bothered. <laughs> I can't be bothered thinking about this anymore. I'm doing it. I'm going to target them with the Book of Arcan, giving Very them nice. an eight inch move. Mm -hmm. um, it does the book uh, fizzle and lose its power? It does not. It sticks around. We've got that real book. The real book. <laughs> Um, it's, like so, a, it's like a hardcover rule book yeah, compared to a softcover. Look at the hardcover. <laughs> yeah. uh, so we'll move those zombies in and we'll be back. All right. And that is where the huge zombie bus ends up. They hit the unit. They weren't able to close the door because of the bats. So the knights closed the door to them. All right. We got a lot of combat here, people. It's, it's happening. I got sick of waiting and I maybe made some bad decisions, but flame me in the comments. I don't care. <laughs> I just, I was sick of waiting. So let's fight. Fight. <laughs> um, and you know what? Let's, let's do this one first. It's charges first. So actually, no, let's go down the line. Let's go to the fell bats first. Um, so your fell bats lost combat. Are they initiative two? Yes. Very good. No, so, three. Oh, initiative three. Initiative three, yeah. Graveguard three. is also three. Ah, very good. Yeah. So three to three initiative. So the Graveguard will go first. Um, and there are six of them in that rear rank. So mm. they will be swinging at them, hitting on threes. Ooh, 
missing half of them. Okay. <laughs> Not so fresh, Graveguard. Uh, wounded on threes. Very good, Ooh. getting all of those. So we kill two fell bats because one was on one wound yep. remaining. That's right. And that leaves a single fell bat left, sir. Um, he can Attack swing back with two all attacks. Right. Let's do that. He got one hit. One hit. <laughs> one hit, wounding on fives. He oh, he's it. done it! That's an angry bat. Three up armor. Ah! <laughs> he, he kills a grave guard. Very disappointing. Um, so, due to ranks and brats, and banners yep. <laughs> and kills, bat is dead. He, he crumbles. crumbles and he's gone. Bye bye. The fellest of bats. Alright, um, all right. then we'll come down to this one, we'll come down to all of the skeletons and Dragus love against more lame bats. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, it will be Dragus love first. So he, as a vampire count, has four attacks. He is hitting on threes. Oh, Dragus Love gets a single hit. Oh boy, Dragus Love. Okay, he's not used to just fighting <laughs> lame little bats, apparently. <laughs> um, he's strength six. He's killing on twos. Yeah, it's a four. He does a wound to the bats. Lovely. Right. Oh, that's not good. He was supposed to be the workhorse that was going to carve through them. <laughs> There's Ouch. a lot of wounds to carve through here. <laughs> um, it's going to be my Necromancer with a single attack. Missing. Very good. This is going poorly. I've made bad decisions. <laughs> Three skeletons and a skeleton veteran, whatever they're called, um, uh, hitting on fours. Ooh, uh, getting a single hit. Whoa, oh god, wounding on ah. oh, <laughs> We did yeah, a single horrible. wound. All right, so you can attack back. That's great. So we got twenty attacks. Jesus, <laughs> this was a very bad <laughs> mistake. <laughs> <laughs> this, was, this was a mistake. Yeah. Uh, but all right, five. that's fine, that's fine. Here we go, so then they have a weapon skill of, oh, they got three. Weapon skill of three. Very good. So what are we hitting on? Are you putting them all into the, into unit? the unit? All yeah. into the unit. All in the unit. Very good, sir. So, I'm um, hitting on, they got weapon skill three? So uh, yeah. Then they're hitting that's on fine. threes, mate. Because the weapon skill two skeletons. That's a lot of attacks. 14? 14. 14. 14 hits. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Uh, strength two? Uh, I believe so, yes. Winning on fives. Winning on fives. Oh, come on. <laughs> One? A single goddamn wound. A single wound. Freaking hell. Wow. Um, oh. We have light armor, hand weapon, shield for no a four fun. up armor save. No, a single skeleton does go down. <laughs> so I win. You're unbreakable. Yep. That continues. That's. That's very bad. That's going to be a whole game there. Yeah. That's, that's not good. <laughs> oh boy, this, this was a mistake, but they had to get attacked. They were going to attack me. I had to do something. Yep. This was not good. All right, cool. Then we come down to this one. Here it is. It's zombies. Zombies and more zombies versus whites. A white lord and a vampire Strigoi count. Very mm. cool. You go first because we have the brain dead rule, so we even oh, yeah, do not yeah, attack that's, first that's on correct. charge. Yes, true. Um, so I guess it would be the we'll Strigoi, Strigoi first. first. He's the yeah. fastest. Yep, he's got five attacks. Spicy. That's weapon skill is seven. Very good, he will be hitting on threes. Oh, he well, just gets them the all. barrows is yeah threes anyway so oh, he doesn't he doesn't um get the barrows, oh, barrows whites only yeah, whites yeah, only yeah. um very good he got them all anyway strength five um two toughness three winning on twos culling on twos very good five of them perfect oh, dice wins. for you sir very good that's disappointing <laughs> um all right very good and then cool. uh, and then we're gonna go let's go with our white lord fantastic so he's got weapon skill four he has three attacks three attacks hitting, hitting on, on threes yeah hitting on threes anyway getting oh one hit one hit <laughs> very good strength four base so winning on threes very good he kills Another a zombie one. um and then yeah. the rest of them what yeah. have we got uh, one, two, three. Oh, his horse his horse oh his horse yeah, yeah okay. so he's got a little clip clop horse hitting on threes hits Wounding on that. Beautiful. Very the nice. horse takes one down. And then we've got the rest so of them. One, two, three, four attacks. Four attacks. Four attacks cool. from the Black Knights and Hell Knight on threes. Ah, oh, all, all the hits. Hit. Look at you go. Perfect Lovely. dice. And threes. Ah, uh, two oh, more. Two wounds. Okay. Boom. Boom. Very nice. Um, and then it's going to be three horses. Three horses. Here we go. Hitting on fours. Oh, Nothing. very good. <laughs> All right, sir. So two, four, six, eight, nine wounds. 
There you um, go. And you've got a rank and a banner. Mm -hmm. um, what well, you get to attack back now? Though. Oh, you don't. No, no, because you just, they're all you just killed them all. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you killed them all. Yeah. Um, and then I have three ranks, a banner, and outnumber. So we are crumbling by a further six. Oh, oh boy, that was a lot. That's a lot mm. of zombies. Yes. Almost like twenty <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> for the first round. Mm. And that was knights not on the charge. Oh boy. <laughs> Very good. All right. The zombies got culled pretty solidly. Um, maybe I should have waited because then I would have... Anyway, it doesn't matter. doesn't matter. Mistakes were made. Let's mm -hmm. keep rolling with it. <laughs> <laughs> but that is it. That is the end of Blood Dragons Turn 3. Strigoi Turn 4. Charges to declare. And we've got one? We do. Tell me about it. These ghouls here are going to jump back into the graveyard and try and... <laughs> Very Avenge good. their friends that are fleeing. Very good. They're going to charge the flank of the grave guard. Lovely. So that's the only charge. That's and the then only charge, uh, yep. before we move charges, mm -hmm. we rally fleeing troops. Yes, we do. Um, are they within nine? I would think so. Maybe this guy here. Yep, they are. Yes, Very they good. are. Very good. Okay. So they should nine. nine. Come on. They're coming do back. It. Yes, yeah, they are. Very good. They'll rally back and just the stay there. Um, cool, that brings us to move charges and remaining moves. So, this is where everything is now, and this is where everything ends up. Give us your wrap up, Dwayne. All right, so the skeletons have just wheeled a little bit, trying to face off against those fell bats that keep evading us. Indeed. We're gonna do this like chess, okay? This is your king, this is my last three pieces. We're just gonna try and corner you. <laughs> To force us into battle. Corner the fell bats. <laughs> this is the thing. With, with them only being able to move four inches and three turns left, mm -hmm. if they just tried to come up here into the fight, they're not going they're to. They're not going to make it. One, yeah. two, three. They'll end up here yeah. by turn six. Yep. And it's similar around that side. Not going to happen. So they don't really have a purpose except to mess with my bats, I guess. Yep. <laughs> um, very good. Um, he moved up there. They moved over here. Correct. So that's pretty much it. Oh yes, and the the poor poor ghouls. They did not make the charge. They did not. They were just out by an inch. Indeed. Very sad. Um, and then yeah, that, that's, that's it. Movement. That's mm -hmm. it. All right. So it's magic time. Magic I've time. I've got my six dice of please don't hurt me, and you have how many dice now? Three. Three. I've dice. got three. Oh boy. Oh, do I know? I got four. No, you should I? have four. Yeah, yeah, four. Yeah, four. Yeah, four. Four dice. Okay. All right. So what are we doing? <sighs> okay. We are gonna try and cast. Curse of Years. Curse of Years. On. And it's going on that unit. It's the only one that's unengaged. Indeed. So, on the whites. Here we go. Casting on 10 plus. Very good. Four, oh, three dice. I'm going to use three. Can't Indeed. I'm going to use three, so one's going to be wasted. I'm going to use two dice for this. Oh, okay. Mate. Double six. Greedy. <laughs> the greed is real. Can I cast the same spell twice? No. No. Okay, so it has to be something else. Which what other spell does he know? He knows uh, two spells. Yeah, he knows the you know the one that gets to move undead units, but everything oh, is too far vandals, away. So we're yeah. using three. Very good. Back to three, three dice. Three, three dice. Doesn't nah, it doesn't do it. Nope. Bagger. No Human. magic. All right. So we have not been able to cast the spell in four turns. No, sir. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's, it's been a bit rough on the the magic side for the Strigoi. Yes. But I don't know, man. Position wise. I think you're the chip leader at the I moment. Think, I think so. I think, yeah. yeah. I think you've, uh, you know, I made some bad I calls. I was planning to come in here with this unit and hit them in the flank. Wow. Yeah. Spicy. I wouldn't yeah. have seen that coming from mm. a mile away. Um, the zombies charge me. Bastards. Indeed. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Little um, all right, sir. Well, it's, it's combat phase. And we've still yes. got a couple. Do you want to start with the knights or the bats? Yeah, let's go with the bats. Bats the first. The bats are fun. I think you... Uh, my first. vampire would definitely go first. Mm -hmm. What's the initiative of the bats otherwise? Oh, one. <laughs> one? Okay, cool. They're going last. Yeah, they're okay. going last. All right. Dragus love, it's time for you to redeem yourself, mate, and not just kill a single bat. <laughs> Come on, mate. <laughs> Swing away. You've, you've got your eye in now. On threes. Ah, oh, he misses one. Yeah, misses okay. One. That's pretty good. Okay. It's pretty good. And then twos. Yeah, he slays three bats Ooh, this time. Right. Well done, mate. We've taken four wounds now. Very yeah. good. One base is down to one wound remaining. Um, we'll go Grigori the Rotting. Missing. Very good, Grigori. And then four attacks from the skeletons. Oh, yeah, Ooh, that's oh. more like it, boys. Four fives. And then threes to kill. We kill another two of them. So one base is down to four wounds remaining. Correct. Yep. Very good. Okay, cool. And now they can attack back. 
It's the Kens who got 15 attacks 15, this time. Slightly indeed. less. We've got six combat phases to get through these guys, yeah, and then the game is over. <laughs> ah, boy. Here we go. 15. Come on. Lots of hits there, I think. What are they hitting on? Um, weapon skill they're three. Hitting on fours. Hitting on fours. Your weapon skill is three, is it? Um, oh, sorry, no, they're hitting on threes. threes. Apologies, oh, yes. Cool. Nine hits. Nine mm. hits in the end. Very nice, sir. Wounding on fives. Wounding on fives. Here we go. Single um, wound. A single wound again. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. It's all uh, they can do, apparently. Yep. Four up armor save. Ah, but they still kill a skeleton. Nicely done. All right, sir. Well, that means um, you win. I stay. Uh, well, sorry, I win, you stay. Mm -hmm. And this time, what I should have done last time, is I am going to expand my frontage Ooh. to this and this. Mm. Very good. Um, oh, no, wait, I have to expand everything. I'm going to lap around. Oh, no, hang on. All right, so after looking at this, I have de uh, decided that what I have to do here is expand my frontage before I can start lapping around, because it talked about if you already extend the enemy's flank, and because... These guys were overhanging a little bit, <laughs> you know, I wasn't extended to the flank. So instead I've taken boys from here and expanded the frontage out this way, so that on my next combat phase, if I win, I can begin lapping around. So, so there it is, I've, I've done the thing. Look at this, expanding frontage and lapping around rules, this never happens. <laughs> That's why I don't know, I understand really how it works, but I'm figuring it out. Um, okay, cool. That's this combat done. Let's let's move on to the the likely demise of the zombies. I just need a couple to still be there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sir. It's your it's your vampire first. Here he is, the vampire, vampire first. Count. Here we go. Five attacks. Oh boy. <clears throat> Hidden on threes. Very good, he misses one, but you may re-roll it for infinite hatred. Yeah, very good. And then it's slaying on twos. I want to see a couple of ones here, mate. Oh, you just got one. one. Just one. Okay. Very good. So you kill four. four. Very good. Four of these zombies get splattered by the claws of the Strigoi. Ripping them to shreds. Indeed, mate. Now we'll go the um, White Lord, eh? The White Lord. Yes, so he has three attacks. On threes for the Banner of the Barrows. Ah, oh, look at you with your He's perfect dice. Would you stop it? Love it. <laughs> <laughs> and then threes. Three. Strength four to toughness three. Okay. Just one. No, just the one. Just one. Again. Um, let's do His the horse? knights. And we'll do all the horses okay, together. Okay, sure, sure. The um, knights, we got four, yeah? One, two, three, four. The four champion. attacks, yeah, mm -hmm. because of the champion. Hitting on threes. Hitting on threes. That's two hits. Very good. Wounding <laughs> on threes. One wound. One wound. Boom. Um, and then it's going to be four horses. Four horses. Okay. The four horsemen. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Um, getting um, two hits because yep. they're weapon skill two. Okay. Um, and wounding on fours. No, None. No, oh my goodness! So not so good. The butcher's bill this time. So two, four, six. I still don't get to attack back. Mm -hmm. um, I've got three ranks, or I had three ranks. Um, banner, and I've got 15, 16, 17. You would outnumber. Mm. Um, so I am crumbling by three. Excellent. The zombies hold. Amazing. Love that. You counted the standard? Ooh, maybe not. Do I count my standard? Damn it. I can't <laughs> ah, God damn it. Let's do it again. Yeah. Okay. All right, we did it again because <laughs> I forgot his rank and banner. Mm. So five is what I crumble by. So that's the first three and boom, boom. There we go. But the zombies hold. They sit They're there. They're still there. They're still there doing their zombie business, mm. holding it up. Your bats are here. My zombies are there. <laughs> oh, I think my zombies are significantly more expensive than your bats, though. So, <laughs> goo -hoo. Um, Very good. So, that's it. That is the turn done. That is the end of Strigoi. Turn four. Blood Dragons, turn four. Charges to declare, and I don't think I'm doing any. I could charge the, the dogs who are now in the flank of the knights. Uh, you know, that'll break their ranks for a turn, and I don't know, give, maybe give me a, a combat res um, for, for a flank charge, but uh, I'll probably just lose them to res after they get butchered here, so... So I don't think it's worth it yet. Um, and I could throw my, my bats still into the thrall, but similarly, I don't think that's worth it either. Throw away the bats, methinks not. So, no charges. That brings us to remaining moves. 
This is where everything is now, and... This is where it ends up. My dogs have just shuffled a bit in the back to get back into the rear arc of the, uh, the knights while keeping a vision arc on the ghouls, just in case they want to come and say hello. Um, and my bats flat flapped over into the corner, just continuing to, to flap around these guys, <laughs> harrying them and annoying them mercilessly as bats are wont to do. So that's it. We go to magic phase and I need to make these zombies great again. <laughs> <laughs> so here we go. I've got my, my eight dice. Um, two, three, one and two. Yes, my eight dice. Um, and I will start by targeting that unit of zombies with an invocation of Nehek. And I'm going to go the, uh, the 3d6 from Kaiser Blackhand looking for a seven plus. Yeah. And I get it, mate, on a 12. Ooh. Yeah, now you can have that one. Fantastic. 2d6 plus two zombies coming into that unit. Oh, for 12 Ooh. of them. We'll start with 12 zombies. Amazing. Very good. Grigori the Rotting is going to do it as well, targeting them with another 3d6, looking for the 7 plus. Oh, and I get it on an 8, sir. I will dispel. Very good. Makes sense. Oh, and you don't! Seven. A double one! The double automatic one. fail! Yep. So another 2d6 plus 2. So 5 will be uh, 8. No, sorry. 5, yes, will be 7. What am I saying? Oof. Another 7 zombies. Where is it? There we go. Another 7 coming in. Very nice. That leaves me with 2d6 left. Yeah, and uh, Dragislav will, <laughs> will do it as well. Um, and he is going to... Hmm... Yeah, he's just going to pump them up. Same thing, pump up the pump up the zombies. Um, you know what? He's going to go for the seven plus on two d six. He's feeling greedy. Ah, and he fails. Ooh. Oh, the greed. That's the first spell that I've failed to cast <laughs> in terms of just failed on the dice. Yeah. There you go. There you go. And then you know what? I am going to target this unit with my Van Hell's Dance Macabre with the Book of Arcan. Does it? Does it run out of of, of stuff? It does not. Fabulous. So they're going to get an eight inch move back Ooh. with that. All right, the Grave Guard were unable to make their charge with the with the eight inches because it started to, you know, chunk into their movement the moment they entered the difficult terrain that is this graveyard. So, you know, with the, it took them like, I don't know, half an inch to get to the edge of it. And then with their 3.75 inches left, they just wheeled into it, you know, potentially getting ready to do something over there eventually, maybe in a couple of turns, maybe not. <laughs> Um, all right, and that is it. And this is, you know, the zombies re-swollen with 19 zombies after that magic phase. Pretty spicy, that was a lot of zombies. Um, it's back to combat. It's back to combat. Um, and let's let's start with the bats, because why the heck not? Um, and it's Dragus Love swinging at bats on threes. Yeah, he gets them all this time. Dragus Love on twos, yes. Four, he just kills a base by himself, amazing. And then let's continue. We'll go Grigori. Oh, Grigori hits a bat. Grigori kills a bat. Ooh. Amazing. Grigori's mad. Um, and then this time we will have four, five attacks from the from the skeletons because there are four yep. of them, and one is the champ mm -hmm. uh, on fours. Mm. <laughs> That's a lot of ones, skillies. Mm. And threes. Ah, Ouch. damn it, skeletons. <laughs> <laughs> All right, your bats can swing back, sir. All right, we're going to go five attacks into Grigori. Oh, snap. <laughs> That's, <laughs> yeah, I wondered when that was maybe going to happen. <laughs> five attacks into Grigori on, uh, ooh, no, oh, no. no hits. <laughs> no hits. <laughs> no hits. Oh, oh bats. That's, that's terrible. And five into the, five, the skeletons. Um, yeah, I mean, could I do the other five on Grigori? Nah, they're not in base they're contact with him, unfortunately. Yeah. All right, into the unit. Oh, I should have rolled like that earlier. Yeah, yeah oh. indeed. Getting three hits okay. and fives for strength two bats. Nothing. No, nothing. Oof. All right. And then this time I will lap around with two models to get some more skeletons Ooh. into combat. Bang, bang. There we go. I'm doing it. I'm doing the thing with Getting the tactics there. and the Getting stuff. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, that's them done, sir. Let's kill some of the zombies that I just raised. <laughs> all right, it's going to be it's going to be Malakas. Yeah, right. Malakas. Very good. Hitting on threes. Go. Rerolling everything. 
Oh, he misses two this time yeah, to start off with, but re-rolling for Rolls. infinite hatred. He hates forever. Hate Gets them all. Beast. Very good. It wounding on twos. Ah, rolls a single one. So four boys do go down. Four of the zombies get half. Oh, I pulled five. There we go. Four. Um, and then the White Lord. The White Lord hitting on threes. Oh, oh boy, hit. single hit. Wounded on threes. Killing on threes. Yes, he gets one. Boom. And then three Black Knights okay, slash six so attacks. Ah, sorry, put four attacks. Yep. On threes. There we go, Ooh, three hits, that's yeah. better. And killing on threes, squishing zombie brains. Ah, oh, just one. one. Okay. And then it's going to be four horses. On fours, getting two hits. And fours. Nah. Then, nah, so useless. two, four, six. You got six wounds. You still have a rank and a banner. Um, and do you outnumber? What do you got there? All right, so 21, so I have 25. So you don't outnumber. Um, so I got, I still have three ranks, a banner, and outnumber. So I only crumble by three this time. Mm. Oh, mate, I'm in a, a, a zombie plus. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Very good. I'm not in a deficit of zombies. Coming. They'll mm. just keep bringing them back, mate. Just keep bringing them back, zombies. <laughs> Um, all right, the big tar pit is pitting. So that's it. That's it. I'm getting through the bats. The tar pit is doing it. Heck mm. yeah. Working all right, out. that's my turn done. That is the end of Blood Dragons, turn four. Strigoi, turn five. Charges to declare, and we're declaring some. Ghouls. Ghouls. These ghouls are going in the front. These ghouls are going on the side. Very good. Two ghouls swinging into the graveyard. Um, uh, bl yep, sweet. Well, that'll bring us to, that'll bring us to remaining moves slash move charges. So, uh, this is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. Give us your wrap up, Dwayne. All right, so skeletons have swung around to face the bats in case the bats get brave enough to fight. Very good. Strigoi's come down to sort of support the skeletons there. Um, our ghouls failed their charge. They ended up on the fence line. They didn't make it. So sad. Didn't make it. Uh, these ghouls made it though, of course. Uh, Indeed. They're in the front there. We need to have a swing. Heck yeah. Um, yeah, and then these ghouls have moved down to face up against the dire wolves. Indeed. Put some pressure on the wolves. Charge me. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Very good. Cool. That's movement. That is movement indeed. All right, it's magic, sir. You got your three dice. I do. Slash, Look, you got your um, four dice. Four dice, yeah. Unfortunately, it has to be cast on an unengaged unit. Curse of Years? Yep. Oh, snap. So it has to be the Dire Wolves. Oh, well, we're casting Curse of Years <laughs> on the Dire Wolves. On four freaking Dire Wolves. Okay. Oh, okay. Here we go. All right, mate. No, it no, doesn't go off. No. It never goes off. No. Of course not. Not with three not dice, mate. Right? <laughs> not with three dice. That's why the Vampire Lord is good. You can be throwing four dice at a Curse of yeah, Years if he gets it. That's true. Mate, it's spicy. Um, all right. Well, that's Magic Phase done. It's, it's combat. We had one charge. Do you want to start with that? Where do you want to start? It doesn't yeah, let's, really matter. Let's, yeah, we'll start with the charge. Start eh? with the charge. We've so, got the ghouls again. I'm going to declare a challenge. Very good, sir. And um, oh, do I... Nah, you know what? My, my Crypt Keeper, my, my, my champion will take it. Take yep, it. The okay. Crypt Keeper cool. will take yep. it. Very good. All right, so let's three attacks from the Ghast yes. Ghoul against the Crypt Keeper. Come hitting on, on fours. Oh, he's yep. got an auto wound. auto wound. Very nice. And a hit. Indeed. Wounding on uh, fives. Strength three to toughness four. Oh, Ooh. two wounds. Two wounds, my dude. You son of a gun. <laughs> two wounds, my dude. What the hell? Oh, God. <laughs> um, all right. Strength what in the three. Heck? Strength three. We have three up armor saves. I need to make them both. Otherwise, I've just lost my Crypt Keeper. Oof. And that's, that's very, very disheartening. Three up armor saves. Does the heavy armor, the, the patinaed bronze armor and shield clang it off? Oh, it does. It does. Yeah. Amazing. He raises the shield, catches one on the shield, and one bounces off a, a pauldron. Lovely. Very good. He's going to swing back, needing threes to hit. Oh, he gets Ooh, them both. Yes. Needing fours to wound? Oh, no wounds. no wounds. He can't put down the ghast. Spicy. Going at each other. Indeed. All right, then it's going to be the Mad King, Krannon. Um, he's got three attacks. He's hitting on threes. Yes. He is a uh, strength four base, so wounding on fours, but fives. Oh, beautiful. He kills one, mm. but just the one. Um, and then we've got uh, Kaiser, Kaiser Blackhand. 
hits Kaiser Blackhand. Wounds, he kills Ooh. a ghoul. <laughs> Kaiser, mate, you are wow. the one. You're the main character, Kaiser. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then we've just got another one, two, three, Grave Guard. Three of the regular Guardians of the Grave hitting on threes. Mm, getting two hits. And fours to kill. Ah, they kill another oh. two themselves. Well Gosh. done, boys. Well done indeed. All right, sir. So how many did I kill just then? Three? Uh, that four. was... Four, yeah. Killed four. killed four of them. Um, I've got three ranks, banner, outnumber. So you, sir, are two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, nine? Yeah, so they break matter. automatically. They break, yeah. They are running. They are oh, running. Um, and I will... Pursue? I think I will. It's just going to get me extra movement towards them. So yeah, I'll pursue. Heck oh, yeah. Cool. Let's go. Oh, that's not good. Four. Uh, four inches, and we will go after them. Seven. Yeah, we go destroy on. the ghouls. They go on seven inches forward. I wonder Oof. if that clips. Probably not, but we're going to give it a red hot go. We'll be back with where that... Oh, actually, we'll just... Because that will actually happen at the end of the combat phase. Right. Um, shouldn't have even gone that far into it. But seven. anyway, okay. seven. Yes, yeah, not... Seven. They will be moving seven directly forward at the end of that. Cool. Spicy. That was pretty good. Where do you want to go next, sir? We'll go, yeah, over to here. Over to the big one? Yep, the big, big one. one. Lovely, here he is, Malachus, and his knights still just trying to hew through rotting flesh. Malachus, here we go. Malachus, yeah. hitting um. on threes. Ah, oh, gets him, oh, and this is one, but infinite he hatred. Hates him so much. He despises them, oh, but not enough. No. <laughs> <laughs> Wounded on twos, killing on twos with his great claws. Oh, oh double bad. one! Oof. He only kills two this time. Two. Oh, big deal. All right, we'll go to the White Lord next. The White Lord's uh, on threes. threes. Very good. He gets, he gets them all this them. time. Very good. And then threes to kill. Spicy. Two. He puts down two for himself this time. Beautiful. Let's do the four Black Knights. Indeed. Four Black Knight attacks. Yep, hitting on threes. Wow, look at those sixes. Yeah, wow. Very nice. Um, I'll keep the four. The four oh, is yeah, a hit. Yeah, four, yeah. They okay. all hit, yeah, mate. Yeah, cool, cool. <laughs> um, and threes. Threes to kill here. Cool. Spicy. The Black Knights do the business. Very nice. Another four by themselves. And then four horses, sir. Okay. Never forget the horses. Yes. Never forget. And one horses. What have we got? No. Nah, nothing. nothing. <laughs> All right, sir. So you've gotten four. You got seven kills. You got a rank and a banner. Um, and right now you do outnumber. Um, and I had three ranks mm -hmm. and a banner. So we are going to crumble by a further seven. seven. Seven of the boys. Oh, dear. Oh, the butcher's bill is large this Ooh. round. Very nice. Very Mutra zombies, but they are still there. If I target <laughs> them with holding. a bunch of magic, uh. <laughs> they could be swollen again. <laughs> <laughs> um, all right, now we come down to the bats and we come down to Dragoslav. So Dragoslav, um, who is oh, actually not in combat not anymore. Not in combat. Oh. You pulled the base so he was out of combat. Yeah. <laughs> it's very disappointing. <laughs> very disappointing indeed. Mm. All right, well, let's go Grigori. He hits Grigori. Now, nah, Grigori. <laughs> um, and then I will have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven skeletons this round. Seven skeletons seven on fours. Whoa, skellies oh, are angry. Nice. Skellies are angry. Grigori, I mean, not Grigori. Dragoslav is like channeling his power into them, seeing as he doesn't get to fight. And threes. Ah, bugger. Only two. Two wounds done. So we are on three now. Indeed. Three wounds remaining on that base. You can swing back. All right, cool. So let's go five attacks into Grigori. Oh my god. Yep, very good. <laughs> Hitting on fours. Come on. Spicy. Okay. Getting three, three hits. hits. Wounding on fives. All right, let's strength go. two bats. Come on, bats. Take his head off. Oh, they do Ooh, wound him. Wound. Grigori wound. takes a wound. Very good. Oh boy, Grigori. Ouch. Um, and then five bats into the skellies. Yes. Oh. Getting one hit. Oh, sorry, two, two hits. hits. Yep, yes, two yes. Hits. I yeah. keep forgetting cool. the weapon skill three. Um, and no wounds. Yeah. No, wounds. no wounds. Very good. And I will lap around yet again. Ooh. Continuing the lap lap. Boom. We're running laps around you, apparently. <laughs> uh, but sweet, that's it. That's the turn. 
Ah, the, the zombies continue to hold. Ah, we need to move this and see yes. where this ends up. We'll be back with that. The grave guard made it. Oh my God. <laughs> my God. They did it like with their seven inches, they clipped this guy into the back corner and they, they used their, because they were going to touch them, it meant that they used the rest of their movement to maximize in. So, oh man, what a huge swing. What a huge swing. The grave guard have made it into the flank of the knights. Wow. That's brutal. That's brutal, but so lucky. Ah, just because of those those ghouls. <laughs> oh, those poor, poor ghouls. They've undone their master. <laughs> um, okay, but that is it. That's the end of the turn. That is the end of Strigoi, turn five. Blood Dragons, turn five, charges to declare, and I think it's time the dogs came in, so the dogs will declare a charge into the rear of the uh, the Black Knights, because it's time to get some, some bulk combat res and see if I can crumble a bunch of them. Um, so, boom, into the rear, um, and I think that's all I'm doing at charge-wise, because... There's still no point throwing those bats into anything over there. There's just not. Uh, but so, so that is it. That is it. We move on to movement and, and move charges. So this is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. My, my dogs charged into the rear and the bats flat flapped over into the middle of the board. Still just, just flying around being bats. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so that, that brings us to another magic phase. Yes, another phase of magic. And I've still got my eight dice. Um, what am I going to do with them? Oh boy. Oh, you know what? I'm going to, I am going to, from, from Kaiser Blackhand, I'm going to spend three dice to raise a new unit of zombies. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try and raise the dead. Uh, and we're going for the seven plus. Seven plus? Yes, the seven plus on three dice. And I get it, sir, on a 10. Raising a new unit. A new unit of zombies. I'll let it go off. You let it happen? Yep. All right, we're raising a, uh, how many zombies? 2d6 plus two, is it? Plus two, indeed. Nine zombies within 18 inches. We'll get them on the table. All right, and nine zombies come busting through the, the decaying earth of Sylvania to protect the rear of the dogs from potential ghoul charges. I uh, don't want none of that. Mm. So uh, yeah, there's my there's my zombies. Um, hmm, what am I gonna do next? Will I just make more zombies there? Shall I buff them up a bit more? I think so. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a bigger unit of zombies just there. Mm -hmm. So yep. I'm gonna cast uh, invocation in the heck on that unit of zombies, yep. needing um, uh, and I'll just do it on the two plus. Uh, sorry, the three, three plus yeah. with two cool. dice. Get it on a seven. Cool. Uh, I'll let it go off. Ooh, very good. Mm -hmm. Another D6 plus one zombies for three. And there they are. Another three zombies added to the unit. Huzzah! Um, and then I am going to cast Hellish Vigor on this unit right here Ooh. to give them re-rolls to hit in the first round of combat. Hellish Vigor coming out on a seven plus. Yeah. Ooh, I don't get it. Let's I roll a it. five. Ooh. Boo! Boo, hiss. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> that was... No! Ooh! No. <laughs> God damn it. Ah, bugger. All right, well, um, and now I'll use uh, my bound item of Van Hell's Dance Macabre on those zombies. Do you want to stop it? I mean, I might as well. <laughs> I suppose so. Ah, uh, you do. <laughs> you do. Does my bound item finally fizzle? It, it does. does. <laughs> <Boo>. <laughs> it wasn't At a real box. At last. It was a fake one. Indeed. It crumbles <laughs> in the grasp. But such is life. Yeah. All right. Cool. Well, not, not the best magic phase, but such is life. So that is it. That is magic done. It's time for combat. And we're going to do the bats first. Oh, yes. I'm sorry. In my movement phase, he was going to move to displace one man to get into combat. Um, because get him back in there. Um, and here's another question. You know, because, like, you know, at the ends of combats, when he removed this base, it pulled him out of combat. You know, is that, should we have reshuffled these in? Is that what happens or does everything just say static and you have to move your characters into combat, into, you know, into places to be able to, I don't know, to be able to do it. So, I don't know, let me know. Is that the way this should have been done? Can you just pull characters out of combat by pulling bases away from them? But this is how we've done it this time. Let me know. Okay, here we go. And for anyone watching at home, the reason why I didn't target these guys with invocation is because I kind of want them dead. If they die this round, 
and I kill all these bats, on turn six, I could potentially get into that combat. Let's go. And Malakas we could get, exactly. Versus Dragoslav. Versus Dragoslav, the generals. Challenge. You know? That's the whole thing. That's the whole reason I've been trying to get this to happen. Hell yeah. But for that to happen, I need to kill all these bats. <laughs> <laughs> um, technically, I do have two rounds to do it. I've got this round and then Dwayne's combat phase on turn six. So it should be achievable, but let's see. Can we do it? So, we're starting out with Dragislav, swinging at the bats on threes. Ooh, that's not Ooh. a good start, Dragislav, rolling below average. And twos, very good. He kills two bats, putting this down to one wound remaining. There we go. Um, and then we'll go Grigori. He gets uh, weapon skill three. He misses. Damn it, Grigori. <laughs> um, and then it's going to be eight. Eight skeletons. Eight skeletons hitting on fours. Oh, good job, skellies. Not too shabby. Mm. And then threes. And they do it. they oh. put four wounds through, which kills that base. And puts him on two left. Two left. So we didn't be, we wouldn't do it this round, but we still have time. We still have time. Um, and we will continue to lap around another two units to the rear. Hmm. There we go. Look at that. Oh, sorry, you can still get to attack back with that. Cool. Uh, so we're going five attacks into Grigori. Ah, you're not in base contact with him anymore, mate. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes. But wouldn't it reshuffle to the center? No, because otherwise if we reshuffled, he would have still been in combat last turn, mm, which we did okay. not do. So we're, we're sticking with the one way we've been doing it. Okay. All right. Um, so it's All right, into, into the, the unit. unit. Five into the unit. Here we go. Getting... Ooh, not bad. Getting four. Very yeah, nice. Cool, cool. All right. Four hits, wounding Wounds. on fours, no oh. fives. A single wound, single wound. a four up armor save. Ah, you kill a skeleton. Kill one, Boom, a skeleton goes down. All right, and that is, that is where that combat ends up. They've got two wounds left. We should be able to kill that next turn. Mm. Um, oh boy. All right, sir, so then we come over here. Here it is, it's the big one. It's the, the, the whites. And, and that guy, <laughs> the, the grave guard have finally slammed in, the, the wolves that have been dancing around the back have decided the time is now and they've slammed into the rear. It's, it's a big one. So um, it's declare charges and, and white lord King Cranon the Mad will declare a challenge. Do you accept and who with? Uh, yes, yeah, we'll go with the champion. With the unit champion? Yep. Very good, the unit champion will. So, you know what, I'll just move, I'll him. move him and yep. him. And there he is, there he is, the white king, moving to fight the champion. Very good. All right, white king Cranon has three attacks. He is weapon skill four? Could you check the weapon skill of a white king? Uh, of a white lord yes, is thank you. four. Well, excellent. So he will be hitting this man on threes. Oh, only getting one hit. That's not a good start. Oh. That's not a good start. He is strength four to his toughness four, but on a five up, he will just be killing blow. He'll be cleft oh. in twain. Now he doesn't even wound him. Oh, Brutal. Wow. Oh. Damn it, White King. <laughs> <laughs> Damn you, King Credon. All right, attack him back, mate. Attack him back. Here we go, hitting on three. That's one hit. One hit. Come on, killing blow. Let's go. Killing blow. Six. <gasps> Six. Oh. No, but he does wound him. He does wound him. He has a three up armor save with that heavy armor and enchanted shield, which goes to a four up. Whoa. He saves he it. Saves he saves clangs that. off the enchanted shield. Lovely. Mm. All right, then it's going to be the rest of the whites into the unit. So we will have one, two, three, four, five. Five attacks from the remaining whites into the, the black knights. Looking for threes to hit. Yeah. Oh, missing two of them. Not the best. This will be fours to wound, but sixes are killing blow. Come on, give me some sixes here. Do it. Do it. Not a one, but a single oh. wound comes in. Oh, jeez, this has gone really badly. <laughs> <laughs> um, so that'll give a three up armor save, mate. Because okay. it's just negative one. And you save it. it. Jesus. <laughs> Gr oh, <laughs> Grigori is going to swing. He hits. Oh. I mean, not Grigori. Grigori. This is Kaiser. Kaiser. Oh, Kaiser. Doesn't wound. Mm. Damn it, Kaiser. Um, all right, well, I caused no wounds with my lovely flank charge. Good work, guys. <laughs> um, it's the wolves in the back. We've got four wolves and a doom wolf. They're swinging in on fours to hit. 
Oh, nice work, boys. They're angry wolves. And they're wounding on fours. Getting one, one wound. <laughs> one wound. Oh, this has gone very poorly. Um, a three up armor save, sir. Ah, oh, a knight falls to a wolf. wolf. A doom wolf pulls down a knight. Amazing with On slavering back. charge. Very nice. Love that. Um, all right, sir, you can swing back. All right, so let's go hmm, vampire count into the zombies. Let's just finish them off, eh? Yep, fair. <laughs> Get rid of them. That's five attacks. Yes. There you go. <clears throat> Hitting on three. Very good. Re Getting that one. Oh, yes, of course. Sorry. Because I hate them so much. You'll despise yeah. them. Yeah. And twos, sir. Twos to wound. Let's finish him off. That, oh, four. Four. Four wounds. Dunk. Okay. Dunk. Dunk. Very good. And then we've got uh, White Lord. Yep. And he's just got three attacks. Hitting all three. Three zombies there. Getting one oh, hit. Only one hit. Okay. All right. Getting one. He does kill one. Oh, oh, that's the that's the musician. I'll take okay. this guy. Uh, what do we get left? We have two that can actually hit. Oh, um, plus the horses, yeah. Indeed, yes. Yeah, so three we'll horses. Go these these two guys first, and then we'll do the three horses. Cool. All so right. So two whites. Yep. Two whites. On one three each. One hit. One hit. And threes. No. Ooh. Three right. horses. Three horses. It's up to you guys. Let's go. Oh yeah, oh, the horses yeah. are mad. Okay. They're quick clopping. <laughs> How mad are they? Do they kill them off? Um, they get Wounding a single on, wound. Yeah, one wound. A single wound. Still got your standard. <laughs> yeah, dude. Amazing. Ugh. I mean, we'll see. We'll see what happens here in terms of combat res, because you did a lot. So sure. I think you're going to win this pretty solidly. Mm. Um, so, oh, that's so disappointing. Two, four, six. Um, and you've got a banner. Um, I got no wounds, which was... Oh, no, well, you got, got one. You got one. One yeah. wound. Thank you, sir. No. Um, I've got three ranks. Uh -huh. I've got a flank. And a rear. And a rear. It's a tie. And a banner. Oh. I win by <laughs> one. So you do one crumble crumbles. one night. Oh. No, we did not want that. Uh, amazing. Okay. <laughs> Um, uh, that's, that's pretty funny. Ooh. Um, okay. Ah, oh, but the zombies remain. The zombies remain. They do. But will they remain for the last round? Probably not. <laughs> um, okay. That's it. That is it. That is the end. I mean, this, this went so poorly. Yep. <laughs> I've got like zero wounds. That whole unit did nothing. <laughs> Very disappointing. But they broke ranks. They put three points of rank bonuses. So they did stuff, but oh. Disappointing. <laughs> but that is the end of Blood Dragons, turn five. Strigoi, turn six. Last turn for the Strigoi, second last turn of the game. Mm -hmm. Charges to declare, and we've still got one. We do. Mate. One charge left. Very good. Our four ghouls that ran away earlier. Yes. I've got the guts to charge into the zombies. <laughs> yeah, they see flesh, they're like, they're corpses, we can eat them. <laughs> <laughs> they gather the courage. Indeed, to get the some, desire for food. Indeed, to mung on some dead bodies. Love mm -hmm. it. Um, that is that's the only it. charge. That's the only yep. charge that mm -hmm. gives us remaining moves. So, uh, this is where everything is now. And this is where everything ends up. Give it to me, Dwayne. What's going on? Okay, so ghouls have charged into the zombies. Indeed, they have. Um, our skeletons have just kind of chilled there. <laughs> you know what? Might as well face the camera, hey? Yeah, Post hell yeah. Aesthetics. Just thematically. Right. <laughs> like, this is our corner of the board. Very good. They've claimed it as theirs. Now, Strigoi's run up there. Our ghouls have run up into that yep. corner of the board. Trying to, to claim a table quarter in yes. the final turn. Yeah, that's that it. it. That's yeah, it. It's, it's mm -hmm. magic time, my man. That's the move and done. Magic. What are you going to do with your, your final spell? Mm. Do you have anything that you can do? Uh, yeah, Curse of Years. Oh, no. It's only on unengaged units, yeah. Everyone is engaged. And otherwise he um, has Van Hells? He does, but... Uh, so yeah, it's not going to be helpful. No, nah, there's right. nothing nearby. So. Bugger. Yeah. Bugger, the final magic nothing. phase comes and goes for the Strigoi without a single we, spell. Yeah, not, a <laughs> uh, not a single spell this whole game. My well, goodness. My goodness. That is sad. That is max sad, oh, mate. Okay. Um, all right, so then it's combat, sir. Where do you want to start? We've Let's, got We've got a few. I just realized I didn't let you, in the last combat phase, you should have been able to attack back with your rear knights into my dogs. We didn't do that. Oh. Let's do that now. Let's do that now because that I forgot that. would have changed combat rares and quite, everything. Quite potentially, <laughs> indeed, mate. Okay. So you would have had, there Thanks would have been an extra out. knight there. Yeah, no, no mm -hmm. worries. I like to do things right, but I forget things sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> so one, two, three, four knights would have been able okay. to attack back into, the, uh, into those guys. Hitting on threes. Indeed. Here we go. Very good. Three Getting... Hits. 
No, no, threes. Threes. One of oh, those yeah, is three. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Cool, cool. Um, and wounding on threes. Ah, oh. nothing changed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, horses, horses, horses. Well, horses. Yeah. Amazing. Last chance. Here we go. Hitting on fours. Oh, wow. There we go. Sounds All right. Good. Cool. And fours. No. Oh, lovely. <laughs> Game state restored. Nothing changes. Game state there you restored. Go. But we did it properly, people. We did. Yeah. We did. Oh, I got it. I caught it. <laughs> Ah, oh, give me some love in the comments, people. Yeah. <laughs> but I think I had a, another horse left, didn't I? Because um, one crumbled, yeah. No, we did four horses, crumbled. didn't we? Or did you only do three? We only rolled three horses. We've got one more of those one horses. Horse. Come on, <laughs> horse. Going into Let's the wolves. Do it. On fours. Lovely. No, <laughs> Nothing I'm so changed. glad I checked the clips. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, we've got to do it. We've got to do it right. <laughs> um, all right. Cool. All right. Lovely. Game state restored. So, let's... Where do you want to start? Now that we've we've actually sorted uh, out okay, last turn. Let's go with the ghouls, hey. Go with the let's ghouls. Go light and easy. Look at yeah. those ghouls slamming into so the rotting we got, flesh. We got a ghast. Ooh, nice. And we got one ghoul, two ghoul, three ghoul. Very nice. Okay, six. Ooh, that's eight, a lot nine. of attacks. Nine my, attacks. My goodness. Very good. Hitting on threes. Poison, come on. No sixes. Wow. A lot, a lot, of, lot of hits. Okay. You only yeah, missed one. Yeah, okay. Not bad. <laughs> um fours. Fours to kill zombies, mate. Let's kill some zombies. Very good. Ah, uh, oh my god, six? No, five. Five. five so you zombies. kill the front rank. So, two, four, five. Five. Mm -hmm. um, which means I don't get to attack back. Um, but so you killed five of them. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I had a rank, an outnumber, so three more crumble. Boom. Boom. Nah. Yeah. Didn't kill enough. Yeah, it's hard to get through zombies, mate. Yeah, they're, true. You know, they're the thick little boys. Very true. Yeah. Um, cool, that's them done. Where mm -hmm. do you want to go next? Let's go with uh, the bats. The bats, yeah, lovely. So and we first. are going to go Dragoslav. Dragoslav is going to finish these goddamn bats. Only two wounds. Yeah, You're only going to get two. On threes. The rugs love. <laughs> Gets two hits. <laughs> Come on, mate. And twos. Ah, oh, he kills one win. of the bats. We've got one win left. Very good. Grigori will finish the bats. Grigori <laughs> on fours. Yes. Grigori on threes. Damn oh, you, Grigori. <laughs> Damn it, Grigori. All right. Um, oh, no, he totally couldn't. Yeah, well, good. <laughs> My bad. No, no Grigori. Um, but then we would have <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine skeletons trying to kill one bat on fours? <laughs> oh, boy, that's a lot of misses. Not bad. Four and hits. threes. Yeah, they do oh, it. We do they it. Do it. Jeez. it took a lot. It yeah. took so much <laughs> of my energy Everything and life had. force <laughs> to kill those goddamn bats. Oh god, I'm gonna redress those ranks later. But oh, oh boy, bats are dead. I did it. Yes. Oh, all right. That brings us over here, and that brings us to the oh. challenge. It is still the challenge between the White King and the the Hell Knight. Mm. So it is just going to be King King Cranon. King Cranon the Mad versus the Hell Knight. All right, King Cranon, we're hitting on threes. Very good. We get two hits and we are wounding on fours, but fives are killing blow. Come on, do it. I oh, does it. Does it. Yes. Kills him. He puts him down him with on. an extra wound. So he's worth an extra in the combat res. Uh, yeah. Lovely. Okay. You did it, Cranon. Love your work, mate. <laughs> um, okay, then it will be the, the rest. All right, so while we were talking about who goes first and what happens then, we just realized that we have completely been ignoring the cursed book, which is mm. what this gentleman has as a magic item, which makes everyone within six, negative one to hit. Spewing. Dude, so spewing. That sucks. That bloody sucks. Yeah, well. uh, but look, from here on out, we'll be counting it all. Even in that challenge just then, at least one of the attacks was a four plus, which would have been a hit both rolls that I rolled to wound were sixes so so that can remain the same but last turn would have been different Every, ah, anyway no. well we remember now but god that's irritating yep um so it's going to be your general against against this, the zombie the one zombie the standard the Come final on, zombie let's go Getting two misses, re-rolling for mm -hmm. that infinite hatred. He hates that standard bear. Yeah, right? he does. Oh. <laughs> kind of. <hates laughs> and it. then killing him on twos. You just need one. And yes, sure enough. Boom. The zombies are finally gone. Finally killed. And the, the standard is captured. 
Uh, but very nice. Cool, cool. So then we would go to my dogs, the initiative three steps. So it'll mm -hmm. be my threes first. So my dogs and uh, yep. Kaiser. Um, so dogs, five attacks from the dogs, four dogs and a doom wolf hitting on fours usually, but fives for the cursed book. We're doing it, huzzah! Oh, we still get two hits, pretty sweet. Um, strength three to toughness four this time, so wounding on fives. Two wounds, wow. Mm. But you will have two up armor saves against this one, my friend, because we are strength three now. Okay. Show me uh, how For how many wounds is it? Just two, just yep. two. Cool. Nah, it clangs off the barding. We don't get through with the wolves. Uh, Kaiser Blackhand on fives. Misses. He would usually be fours, but mm. that book. Um, and now it would be, uh, these guys have nothing to fight now. So then it comes back to my whites. Four attacks from the whites. Now, here's the question. My banner means I always hit on threes. Your thing is negative one to hit. <laughs> All right, so after checking the wording on the banner of the barrows, it does say that any white in the unit will hit on a three plus regardless of weapon skill and any other modifier. So it seems pretty clear that the curse book does not change it. Yeah. Um, so here we go. We have three whites in combat with the knights and one of them is the Crypt Keeper and they will be hitting on threes. Yeah, half the hits, boo. <laughs> We are strength four to toughness four. We're wounding on fours, but all we need to see is a six here. Do it! Ah, we do! Oh, one is killing blowed, and one Go is on. also wounded. So you'll have a can three. Can you hit two now that we're not in base contact? Absolutely, yeah. Just it, It's assumed that you just keep killing through. Oh, okay, sure, sure. Um, so you'll have cool. one three up armor save, mate. One three up. Yeah, oh, no, we killed two knights. Okay. Two knights down. All right. And the unit clinks in forward. Um, so... Mm. Okay, so you don't get to attack back with anything, unfortunately. Nope. Because we killed the units in base contact, so mm. we killed two knights plus two wounds in the challenge against the, the Hell Knight. Um, we have three ranks, a banner, mm. out number. Wait, wait. Oof. Okay, I'm putting this down. You still get to attack my dogs. <laughs> we almost forgot it again. Oh, I do, yeah. These two okay. guys against my dogs. Two black knights. Getting a hit. Getting a hit. Okay, cool. Yeah. Wounding on threes. Killing on threes. Alrighty. No, ah, no. Two horses? Two horses. <laughs> Getting one, one hit. hit. On fours. Yeah, there, there you go. go. Killer you dog. killer dog. Very good. Okay. Okay, let's start this again. So I got two knights, two wounds in the challenge, three ranks, banner, outnumber, um, flank, and rear. Um, and you got two wounds, the, the dog and the one zombie, uh, banner, and that is all. Oh boy. So Oof. two, four, six, eight, nine wounds of combat res, oh, my friend. That's horrible. Oh boy. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, how many does White Lord have? Um, two wounds. Two wounds, is it? Two. Oh. Five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine. So eight, he's on nine. one wound. Does uh, he regenerate crumbling? Ah, uh, uh, we're gonna have to look at regeneration. Yeah, let's look at regeneration. Yeah. <laughs> Brutal. All right, so we just checked. Regeneration uh, happens from from wounds suffered in the phase, but you do not. Regeneration comes off before wounds from combat res. So, so he doesn't get to regenerate the wounds. He is down to one wound remaining. That was a big swing and, you know, definitely the end of the game at this point. Yeah. So uh, let's let's just go on to to the challenge because the challenge is what matters <laughs> pretty much. Correct. Um, so we'll, we'll do it. We'll go through the motion. So that is the end of Strigori, turn six. Vampire counts, turn six, final turn of the game and Dragislav von Kurz is going to charge out of his unit straight into the combat. Boom! He makes it with his 12-inch charge. Um, uh, so look, if if this game was getting a bit, you know, like if this was getting close at this point, which unfortunately after that turn it's not, yeah. um, I would be trying to raise the dead over here in this table quarter. I'd try and raise a unit of zombies to contest it so that we're not getting the 100 points over here. The bats are contesting that table quarter. So, so yeah, that's what I would be doing if we were getting close. We're not, so I'm just going to the, just going to the glory fight. 
the big fight. The two generals finally meet. After both of them, that one is, you know, from head to toe covered in bloody zombie blood. And here he's got little bits of, like, bat wings hanging out of his armor. <laughs> they both had to wade through absolute chaff to find themselves here. But they have found themselves, at last, the two great generals fighting each other. So, Dragus Love, being a dragon, a blood dragon vampire knight, points his sword at the filthy beast that killed his thrall and, you know, lets out, barks out a, a, a disdainful challenge. Nice. And he will accept, no doubt. Of course. Excellent. So here we go. Let's fight it. Can Dragoslav take the one wound from the great beast that is Malakas? So, he has four attacks. He is weapon skill nine to your weapon skill six? Uh, weapon skill... Seven? Seven for a count, I think it is. Seven, yep. Weapon skill seven. So we are going to be hitting him on, ah, oh, you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna cast one spell, giving okay. him hellish, hellish vigor. vigor. Hellish cool. vigor, one time. I get it on a nine. Would you like to try yeah, and we, dispel it? we will do that. Yeah, oh, no, oh, three dice, yep, three dice. That. Yep, That's all bad. good. <laughs> No. Now you don't. So he has spell. hellish vigor. Mm, okay, Lovely. So he's got the four attacks. Rerolling. Yeah. Very good. He does get two hits. Rerolling for the hellish vigor. He gets them all. His strength six to toughness five. He does wound on threes. Now ah, he gets them all. Wow. All right, mate. So we got four, four ward saves. five up ward saves. Okay. And then regenerate. Yes. He gets one. He gets one of them, so he takes three wounds. So he does die at this point and mm -hmm. does not get to doesn't get to fight back. Right. But you can now roll a single dice because you only ever actually lost one wound right. to see if you regenerate it on a four plus. He does. He does, he does okay. regenerate right. it. But then, unfortunately, due to combat res from all of this stuff, yes. he would crumble and die. But you know, just for fun, roll his attacks. Let's see sure. how we would have done Let's for the do fight. It. Just do it. Just roll his attacks. Let's have some fun this yeah, game. Yeah, right. A little bit. A little <laughs> bit of fun. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Very good. Oh, you re-roll. But I do re-roll. Yep. Um, what Everything do we need to but hit? one. You needed fours. Fours. Yeah, because yeah. I have weapon skill nine. Okay. So re-rolling for his his eternal hatred. Mm, Very good. Okay. Getting three hits. And then wounding on fours, because strength five to toughness five. Ooh, ah, he okay. would have got no wounds in response. Have, yeah. So in the end, it is Dragus Love, who is the, the, the so martial prince, us. and he puts him down, reclaiming his, his land. land back. Indeed. Reclaiming this, this little hamlet, <laughs> this little farming, you know, hamlet out on the edge of Sylvania. Ooh-wee, that was brutal. Yeah, oh my brutal. god. Oh my Ugh. god. But there it is, guys. There it is. It is Dragus Love that has taken the victory on this, this monster mash. But we'll have a quick chat about this in the post-game. And there it is. There it is. It is a Blood Dragon Vampire Counts victory yes. in the end. Good Solid game, victory. mate. Good game. Good game? Oh, ah! I mean, it was a game. It was a game. <laughs> It was pretty good over this side. <laughs> Narratively, I think it worked very well. Yeah, it with was the, pretty cool. With the, you know, the standoff at the end with the two generals. I was so very was stoked. Cool. I was yeah. very stoked that we did finally yes. meet face to face. Yep, that was you awesome. Know, if, unfournately, at that point, your general was only down to one wound. Right, so yeah. significantly reduced. But, but Dragon's still, Love got his revenge. He did, he That's did. Good. He avenged yeah. the death of his vampire thrall. He did. He's taken back his territory and driven the Strigoi filth from it, which is, <laughs> which is awesome. Um, it's super cool to see the Strigoi on the field. They are definitely pretty ferocious. Yeah, they, they have a lot of attacks. They're strong yeah, mm -hmm. at attacks and whatnot. They're, they're yeah. maybe, I don't know. all their missed hits. Yeah, they which was hate everything. very cool. Yes. Um, one of the amazing moments was your vampire thrall sidestepping the killing blow Twice from the row. Black Knights. Amazing. God, that was, <laughs> that was great. Um, I love, I love moments like that in Warhammer, right? Definitely, Those moments yeah. where you're like, it's mm -hmm. super unlikely for this to happen. Yeah. And it's a pivotal moment. And then, <laughs> and, it works. and then it happens. <laughs> on a six he was dead if you didn't roll a six twice in a row and he got too. It. God, yeah. it was it's crazy great. god yeah. it was great i love that I that love was that. my i think out of all the little sort of happiness i had in this game that was the moment of glory for me that was definitely it Just that like, was the you pitch. can't touch me yeah <laughs> exactly the slippery strugoids like yeah yeah like super fast yes. doing the, 
doing the vampire phase, right? Just like, brum, brum, doing that, exactly. that super cool yeah. thing. Um, so that was epic. Um, you definitely won, you know, the, the camera right flank. The camera right flank was, was <laughs> the all right yours. flank, sure, we'll, we'll it was, take it. It was we'll the small it. flank, but it was the flank that you did win it. Pretty yeah. solidly, um, you know, pretty solidly. You were close to being destroyed there yeah, with, with that unit mm -hmm. of spearmen, but yep. on your turn, the counter charge came through and everything that was there crumbled. Yes. The Black Knights, the, the Wolves, they were, they were gone. gone. Mm -hmm. But really the, the big pivotal moment of this was the, the ghouls fleeing from combat mm -hmm. and getting cut down by the, the, the Grave Guard right. yeah, and the yeah. Grave Guard rolling like an inch enough. Yeah, just like that's, the... If they had rolled a six, they wouldn't have made right. it. Yeah, but they yeah. rolled the seven, which hit the flank. Um, we talked a little bit already with with my three Van Hell's Dance Macabre. Mm. Maybe over a, a turn or two with some good spells, I could have gotten them there. Yeah, yeah. But to just immediately end yeah, up there because of mm -hmm. a because of a pursuit was huge, huge. Um, it burns my ass that we forgot <laughs> that we forgot. I the know book, the cursed man, book. The uh, book. Yeah, I know. That burns my it ass. It would have saved, maybe saved well, me a wound. I don't know. Maybe because actually, when well, we found the out in the when end, it comes out and indeed. see what you rolled. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Um, you guys already know how much it would exactly. affect things or not. Um, <laughs> you tell us in the comments. Indeed, indeed. But yeah, finding out that the banner of the barrows makes it null and void mm, anyway yeah, yeah. was maybe meant that it probably yeah. wouldn't have been that big. Maybe just yeah. the dogs, which the was dogs, a wound, yeah. which was a wound. Yeah, yeah, cool, super cool. It was fun using a vampire count and a white king or white lord. I keep calling them white kings because in later editions yes, they, white kings, they change yeah. it to white king uh -huh. so that there's no confusion over whether they're a lord right. or not, yeah. right? Because mm -hmm. you know, lord is a very specific thing in this game. So you can see why they did that. True. But, but that was fun, that was cool. Super interesting to play vampires versus vampires. There was some sweet grinding combats there like was, we thought they yeah. were. Mm -hmm. Like Dragoslav just spending turns hacking through <laughs> bats, <laughs> just desperately trying to get to his quarry. Yeah. And poor freaking, I mean, old Malakas probably would have been loving it, just like carving through bodies, just yes. like, yeah, <laughs> in this bestial, <laughs> filthy way. And then they just keep going, and yep. like, yes, more. <laughs> <laughs> so epic, right? So epic. So that was super cool. That was some really interesting and fun, like vampire v vampire yeah, stuff going sure. on. Like I said, you know, narratively it was cool. It was you know, cool. It was a cool story. It was definitely yeah. super rough though. Like, yeah. let's be honest. The yeah. fact that you didn't get a single spell off. I know. Not, not one a game. single spell came yeah, off. I mean, you had so many dispel dice, but you didn't actually need to use any. I think I, think I rolled them like maybe twice. <laughs> twice the whole game. Yeah, and yeah. I always dispelled. It was uh, like, all right, cool. I need to dispel. Yep. I've got heaps. <laughs> <laughs> So um, that yeah. was rough, that was rough. And I yeah. got almost all my spells off. I yeah, think yeah. I failed to roll them like yeah, twice. Yeah, Hellish spell. Yeah, yeah that one, else, maybe yeah. one other one. Mm -hmm. It was, so magic was very heavily skewed to my yes. favor. And not even just because I had more magic, right? It was just the dice. Yeah. <laughs> the yeah. dice were just uh -huh. coming this way yeah. for magic, so ugh. I was like, there's got to be a double six coming soon. Right? Come on. Right? And, and in now. the end, you got a double one. <laughs> <laughs> with <laughs> the damn power cast. stone. I know, uh, with the power stone. And the, the pretender necrovads have like crumbled yep. himself into like, just, <laughs> yeah, the, the magic that was ho holding him alive just, <laughs> and just collapsed into himself in a puff of death. Mm. That was classic, mm -hmm. but also brutal. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> But what a game. It yeah. was a game. We uh -huh. played it. Thank you for playing. It yeah, was, thanks. It was Stoss. a lot of yep. fun. Thanks for coming in Cheers, again. Yep. And the trilogy is mine. Yes, it does. <laughs> in the end. The trilogy. I mean, like, the yep. trilogy doesn't it's end here. You know what I mean? There'll be more games and True. it'll go tit for tat, I'm sure. <laughs> but for now, Stoss. <laughs> yes. <laughs> uh, but there it is, guys. There it is. If you enjoyed it and you got this far and you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. It's just going to put more of my videos in your feed. And if you got this far, I think you probably want that. Um, if you are already subscribed, guys, put a like on the video for me. Any interaction with the video, likes, comments, is just going to help the algorithm keep boosting these videos out to other people that haven't found the channel yet. So help us out, guys. Smash a like on it. Chuck a comment in. Let me know if we've done anything wrong, if we missed some rules. There was a couple of weird rules You don't even need to say that. They will let you oh, know. Oh, they'll know. <laughs> they'll let me they know. They will let you know. But just know that it's invited as well. <laughs>
<laughs> but there was some a couple of weird little rules interactions uh-huh. that I was like, I'm not sure how this works, and mm-hmm. we just kind of made a call and moved forward, which is honestly the only way to play Warhammer. Yeah. As soon as you're not too sure, as long as it's not like this is a game breaking moment. Yes. Make yeah. your best call and move past it. Um, but let me know. Chuck it in the comments. Follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Links in the description. But until next time, I'm Stoss. I'm Dwayne. Happy wargaming. And be good to your mother. Oh! <laughs>